Gravy. 37 seconds. Did you see me testing things? Yeah, come on now. I think the fastest we've had is t like 27 seconds. Who snacks? Hi, Luna. All right. I did just as an FYI, Ravi, I did some tinkering with server settings. So there may be. Oh no, Stu. Oh, that sounds delicious. The, what Ravi said, not Stu feeling like death warmed up. That doesn't feel delicious at all. Stu, what's wrong? Tired? <sighs> um, ads are about to start, I think. Oh, bugger. Okay, we'll hang, we'll hang out and chat. Hang out here. I'm, I'm sorry, I was sick. Is that why you're struggling? Graham crack. Oh man. Oh, I just realized I forgot to eat again. Um. Yeah, I poked it at some server settings to sort of add some fresh meat for Zomboid and. Stu saying that there's now some zombies in, in our housing area, so I'll go through and clear them out today. I think these settings will work better though. And from what I understand, the the wall that you've built, Stu, will prevent things from spawning inside because they can't path inside the cell. The video I post explained it quite well. Um, so not until I've, I've cleared around them yeah it was the way that the guy explained it was really like I really appreciated his the detail that he went to he didn't just say like do this but this is why you do this and I like that you can wear the ball dress around the house once I finish Ravi uh, what I've done is I've made it so that if you haven't been in an area for a week, zombies will start to respawn, but pretty slow. Like it'll take a month to, to build up uh, to the same level as when you clear it. I think it's like a month or just over a month. So that gives time you can go clear an area, you know, go back and forth a couple of times and it, you know, because we're all clusters in one place, it's fine. And between that and the structural thing that we figured out, um, once I get the housing, the, the little housing area cleared out again, it'll be fine. It'll be totally fine. <laughs> Look, they haven't paid their fines. They're, they're not allowed. It ain't on. Um. I remember to get coffee. Ooh, Scooby snack. <laughs> Thanks, Luna. I have a York mid patty. Oh my god, my little candy container smells so good. I'll figure out some food later. I just, I wasn't feeling hungry today, and then I kind of just forgot about it. I forget about eating and and stuff all the time. It's really terrible. I was watching wine the other day, Wine Human. Um, they were playing Lies of P, and I was sitting there. Um, so today watching the stream and I realized I'd been sitting around with cold feet 
all day like my feet were so cold they were hurting and I was like wait I could just put socks on apparently I'm not good at self-regulating anymore don't know what's up with that forget to eat forget to pee forget to drink Forget to dress with a temperature. All right. Let's buff some zombies. I hope you all like my new overlays. I had fun making them on Monday. They even have a fancy transition now. Ooh. I'm learning so much new stuff. Yay, thank you! No more pastels, it's all about fire. I figured I should just lean into it. One bonus. More zombos to kill means more loot, potentially. Maybe I'll find another katana? Where my other gloves went. There was no hope of survival. Uh, but yeah, if if for some reason, um, like the server settings, like for whatever reason, if the server settings aren't comfy, please let me know. Click to start. Now, click to start. <sighs> All right. Now I've got to check my house. <sighs> oh, it's raining. Hello? Oh, I've also turned off um, them being moved. I <laughs> this music um, were redistributed, so it, it means that. Um, once they're cleared out of an area, they won't wander back in. They may start respawning if it's left alone, but they won't, like, amble in. I figured that was the safest. Apparently, I hunger. I like how we've just got like frozen eggs in the freezer. Oh, do I have any snacks? Coffee. Here we go. I was like, man, it is dark. Why is it so dark? Crickets make you unhappy. Alright, there's 
Uh, what do we got? I'm just gonna carry that. I would totally eat a can of pineapple out of the fridge. Um, hey, why aren't I wearing those? This bathroom infuriates me. Oh, good. Good, good, good. It was just using. I've got to go check Toast's place. I might. Oh. Hello. I think we might be okay. Oh no, because Stu said he, he had one in there. In his place. Alright, looks like most place is clear. Well, so maybe Stu was the only one who was lucky enough to get some uninvited guests. What's the light switch of the air? Oh, good. Right. Oh, this was the house that I originally started in. Ravi's like, it's handled. I've taken care of it. I've had my people talk to its people. place is <laughs> oh is it where you are now okay the cutest little houses.
Yeah, I th I'm hoping this will be the last time we need to mess with this. I feel kind of bad <laughs> that, like, Stu got... got got... with a... a, a house to respawn. Here, one here. Hey, buddy. take them out or you can leave them to rot and toss them on the street they'll decompose eventually got to be careful of if there's a lot of bodies is that your character will start you can start feeling sick like i guess you're just like oh my god this is fucking disgusting all right so i cleared the one on the other side of you there were three and this one on the end you okay do you need stitching up or anything? You've got a dirty bandage on your head. I think I've, have I got a clean bandage. Hang on, let me let me fix that for you. Yeah, beta. Sorry about your your head leaked on the ground. Okay. <laughs> I kind of love that you can just go up and be like, "Here's a boo boo." Okay. Uh, so far, we've only found a few. I I wasn't sure, and I was like, you know what? If I just ping the roll, then you will have just a heads up. Uh, Pyro sent me a picture of the character he's created. <laughs> it, it's very entertaining. Alright, actually, you know what? It's probably worthwhile checking the yards, too. My good news is more more bodies more zombies means potentially more loot like katanas and stuff so i i don't know what you mean I like sharp, pointy blades, and I cannot lie. Hmm. 
Oh god, this storm sound is so much. Is it ambient that does storm sounds? I, do, I don't know why I must have all the keys. Get the crap out of me. Oh. Starting at the end of January, customers in my area code are now going to have to start using an area code to make a phone, phone call. We've had an extra um, like three digit thing for, for our city added. I really just want a house with a big kitchen. You know, like lots of storage. I'd also really love if the shelves reflected what was in them. someone yep yes so I've seen some neat ideas um, like using uh, houses as like uh, gate houses for areas. So like building your an entire fence around an area and then like no, like basically getting a house and knocking out like a lower wall at each end of the house and putting gates there so you like have a drive through gatehouse and I kind of love that idea
I know there's one in here. Oh, this is pretty. Ooh. Oh, there's three and four. Whoa. Oh no, game, don't leg on me now. Christ. One, two, three, four, five, six is more. Apparently they were all in this house. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <gasps> the melted ice cream is rotten. Wait, how did that happen? Yeah, I, I mean, I did try and start off doing a, a scratch build last time with Toast helping and Sadie. But I feel like it's probably easier just to take an existing build and customize it. Oh, someone broke down some beds up here. I can't believe how many there were in here. Oh look, Pyra's missing out on all these undies.
Hmm, I'll take that. I really think you should, like, pantyhose, like, tights should give you, um, some bite protection where the zombies just get, like, a mouthful of, like, nylon and it's not delicious. Might as well get some use out of him. There's so much blood on the walls here. Expecting to see you there. Well, that's a cool hat. <laughs> oh no, it's okay. You don't have to come and bring me keys. Look. I think I did, didn't I? No, it's a keychain, but I've already taken the keys. my pile of horses it's a pile of corpses there was a lot in here i thought there were like one or two like this is the i really like this purple in the the front room in this place. Yeah, it's a really pretty color and this has got a nice big kitchen too. It, 
Thanks. Appreciate it. I did my best. I think I did some of my best work there. Oh man, that's sad. A stale zucchini. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to eat the stale zucchini and the stale peach because I'm hungry up here. Apparently killing zombies makes me hungry. Mmm, delicious. I mean, that was a lot. <laughs> Ooh, this has got that nice purple too. Whoops. You can, like, there is paint that you can get. Uh, yeah. But feel free to go through and, like, double check that I didn't miss anything. I'm pretty sh confident that once we've cleared it all, like, unless I change server settings, stuff won't respawn in here. But yeah, if you want to double check my working, that's totally fine. Oh. A sports headband? Oh, I missed an opportunity to put a band-aid on your head. Disappointed. This music is so, like, calm and peaceful. The acoustic guitar. company in this one.
Actually, I suppose putting the, the bodies out on the street is a good way to mark which houses we've gone through. I hadn't thought about that. I guess I need to <laughs> remove all my markers. The places that we cleared because now we've not cleared them again. Oh no, that one was okay. So, next one over. I guess I have to eat. I swear I can hear someone in here still.
Or is it the mu- Maybe it's just the music. I can see your silhouette outside the window, ma'am. Well, well, thank you. I, yeah, I'm pretty sure it was just the music. Why is the ice cream melted? In all of these freezers. And the cheese that was on the freezer rotted. So weird. make a big bowl of pasta so what is up with that sad person no the processed cheese is fine That's fine too. So weird. Oh, whoops. I chug like half a casserole dish of pasta. There's a, a big bowl of pasta, a pot of pasta on the counter if you want food ravi. As payment for checking the perimeter. Wait. Yeah, oh, that's right. Oh. 
Well, heck. <laughs> no! Stop it. Not what I wanted to do. Now what else goes in there? Muscle gloves. Ooh, dangly sapphire earring. Oh, why can I only wear one set of earrings? I don't know if that'll let me do that. Oh, never mind. thing where you can like change them or something oh yeah there we go on this box here nothing okay you know what you can have crafting electronic stuff maybe to work on storage. Yep, that's where I am. Like, I, I keep forgetting, like, this place. And really, just, like I said, getting set up with supplies. So there's, you know, like, new people have got somewhere to go. But this isn't, this isn't where I want to live. And there's a whole massive map out there. We don't have to stay in this area.
<laughs> I keep finding them and I'm just like, ooh, a trailer. I need it. I appreciate it. All right. So, oh good, the sun's coming out. Well, maybe. Wait. I was like, oh, Zombo, wait, no, that's Ravi. Don't, don't run over Ravi. I want to hotwire my trucks. Funny enough, so I don't have to worry about keys. <laughs> Good job, Ravi. on there. Like it's hot. I think pretty sure it's hot wired. It just doesn't show the wires.
That was weird. It had cheese. We have ants popping in 30 seconds. Time to tanned up, tanned up and take a break. Or uh, even stand up. If, if that's what you're into. I need to stop resting my foot on the bar of my desk because it's giving me pain in my feet. All right, I'm gonna shut myself in the closet and take a uh, quick AFK as well. be fine. I'll be right back.
Ah, fuck. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Oh. Oh, Punky, hang on a second, hon. I don't... I have to add permissions. Um. Hi, Drax. Hi, Molly. I don't know why I said that wrong. No, you should be okay. It's a punky. I think I did it wrong. Hello. Sorry. Stream is okay. I had to go hide. I have not been eaten. You know what? Easiest to Hello? You're not muted anymore. Friends. Monkey? I'm a cow, so like, moo, or whatever. Moo. Uh, no, I have not been eaten by zombies or wolves. Um... I did change some server settings, which meant that uh, you were unmuted for a minute there, so I I don't know why that's not working for you. Um, yeah, I changed a few server settings, so yeah, it to to add some more, but what it did is it reset everything so we had to we've got to go and clear out all of these places again which is fine because it's just more loot and more biffing ah what the fuck was that noises apparently I am bored and hungry <laughs> all right I'll just read a comic book and smoke a cigarette problem solved Yeah. Booking some peanut butter pancakes. Sure, that'll do. Yeah, I don't know. As I say, I, initially I thought it might have been a, a permission thing, but your mod thing should override that. <laughs> oh shit, Ollie! Yay, closing in on five years. Deliary one hype, Deliary one dink, donkey, Deliary one spinny love. Deliary one sweet dinky donkey! I know, Ali has the the longest um the dink dinky donkey to you. Uh Ali has like the the longest tenure here. Thank you, Ali, for your support. I appreciate you bunches. Don't forget. Oh hey, it worked. You pick your colour.
I'm so lucky to have friends who when I hang out like it blows my mind sometimes hey look I don't need a ladybug twerking on my butt on my face if, if it's all the same to you Drex <laughs> I, I didn't plan this well. I love that little dancing crab so much. I need I need to find some more gifts to add to it. Are you all trying to get things to appear on my face? You are. Never mind. Why am I asking? I know exactly what's going on there. Uh, but yeah, Drax, thank you for the raid. I I appreciate you. Um. Oh, Drax. Apparently Drax has the skills, yeah. <laughs> Good job. Um, thank you, Drax. For everyone who came over with Drax, if you don't know who I am, um, I, I don't know what to say. <laughs> um, I'm Deloria, my pronouns are she, her. I am currently being assaulted by party gifts. And... Things happen! That is, that is a lot of balloons. Ooh, we got a buddy in here. Hey. Oh, hey, that's convenient. Isn't it great? Look, his blood spatter kind of just like blows into the wallpaper. <gasps> Keys. I'm, I'm a little bit. Look, I, we're, we're never unhinged. I don't know what you're talking about. I like this kitchen. It is. So Pyro hasn't picked his. His was the first stripe of the year. Um, But I was hoping with a pride flag to pick from. Um, It would just be like. Why is all the ice cream in the freezer melted, but everything else is still frozen? <laughs> okay. Green? All right. Let me, uh... Wait. <laughs> Punky Pink Cow asked me, what are the migration habits of the common zombie? Ah, the common zombie, a remarkable creature with the most peculiar migratory pattern, driven not by the seasons, but by an insatiable hunger for the flesh of the living. They roam in haphazard herds, drawn by noise and the scent of life, endlessly wandering until they catch their prey or crumble to dust. Deliria once again sets out to observe and document this peculiar migration in the treacherous landscape of Project Zomboid. What the heck? I'm Ben Tangia. They fucking nail it. They, their, their responses, the AI character responses are so good. Uh, Punky, thank you for asking David Attenborough about Migration habits of zombies. I I don't even know that David Attenborough knew that I existed, so I'm feeling pretty pretty good about being name dropped by him. Really, I'm up there with Bear Grylls. Um. Okay. 
We're gonna get out my tr my trusty book that Punky made me. Hello there. Hi, Carter. We're gonna skip forward. I used about a quarter of your notebook, Punky, last year for notes. So this is gonna last me a while. This is just for stream notes. Um, so we got oh, one, three. Okay, have a good look. Oh yeah, kind of <laughs> more fire, like always. Always more fire. Why is the ice cream melting in the freezer, but everything else is fine? I didn't put hot things in there. <laughs> Thank you, Funky. I really appreciate. I just love everyone. Ugh. Look, I'm getting PMSy, which makes me a little bit more emotional. Okay. <sighs> I we finished Doctor Who last night, and I was doing my best not to like blubber. I'm not looting any food, but I'm gonna take coffee. Oh no, yeah, but that's this is frozen. Or it was frozen. Um, what are we at? 21 days and 174 zombies. But I feel like the day count. Doesn't really count because Stu and Toast have just been like knocking it out of the park. Uh, when I'm not around. I'm just looking for, for dead dudes again. We had, um, we got some, actually we got some Publix ice cream, but it was, I don't know, it, it didn't freeze properly, I guess. It was just like sticky. So Flynn used it to make a, um, an eggnog malt shake. And it was fucking delicious. It was weird that it didn't, the ice cream didn't ever solidify, but yeah, it was, it was great. Um, oh, I was like, what is that? Oh, never mind. Also, I did see this. What was this? What was the vibe check on Snark? Missed that. Twenty six percent snark. Oh well, we'll have to try harder. <laughs> oh, I remember that. Blue Fang. Um, Stream Elements has this thing where. Hey, Flam. Um, it has this thing where it's supposed to do... I mean, that surprises me, but... It's supposed to have, like, a smart timer. And, uh... Oh. Here's yeah, someone. Turn... It's supposed to turn on my blue fang timer when I play Project Zomboid, but it doesn't seem to be working. Where are you? Are you upstairs? I was not scared. Shut up, game. Another one. I've said dog butt so many times it doesn't make sense. Look, buddy, I can hear you burbling away. Oh, 
Oh, there's another one. Hello? Hey, ask by it. Oh. I think it's clear now. <laughs> hey, ass butt. Oh, nice. Um. Oh, yeah. So I don't know if you saw the ping earlier, Ali. Um. But but everything that you cleared has respawned because I decided. Okay, that's good. I decided we needed more challenge. So it's not too much, but it did basically respawn, like it reset things. Yeah. So it's not been too bad. I did find eight in one house, but ooh, key. Um, Stu had one in his place, and I think Ravi said that she had two. So I'm just going back through him. No, I've turned that off. Because that's just no fun. I, I like I, I said to Drax, we're on easy peasy mode here. Easy peasy. Yeah, exactly. Easy peasy. Hey, why? Weird. <laughs> yeah, there's, there's some good looking candy in this game. I, I was exploring yesterday and found black licorice on the shelf and I'm like, ah, oh, fuck yes, hello. I wasn't hungry, but I ate it anyway because that is the correct thing to do when you find delicious candy. No, it's all right, love, you can eat it. Wait, how do you, how do you strike in a stream? Ah, uh, fine. Okay, but this means I'm shutting myself in a closet. Hey, I didn't hear that. Why did I not hear that? Huh. Oh! I. Let me fix this first and then I'll come and get the sandwich. Really? The music just had to get in there? Punky Pink Cow asked me, what's a good use for melted ice cream? Melted ice cream? Don't even get me started. If you've let your ice cream turn into a puddle, you might as well use it as a bloody base for a milkshake <laughs> or pour it over a dessert as a sauce. But honestly, next time, eat it before it turns into a creamy disaster. But now we know. They, that was decidedly less uh, acerbic than what I was expecting. Sorry, I just have to re do this sound or it's going to drive me nuts. I felt like that. <laughs> I there was this. That was, wait, what, in June? What's happening in June? Um, I'm so confused now. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, right, yeah. Sorry, yes.
We oh, here we go. program to bring you this important message. I love you. Now back to our show. <laughs> no, I love you. So there. I I don't know how to brain anything right now. I am so I'm literally just trying to find the sound for the folder for the, my sound effects. Okay, here we go. Hang on. Okay, I I found it. I found it. Hello, this is Emilio, aka Oh God, that's loud. Mexico, with a friendly reminder, please take some time for yourself. Do a oh. stretch. Take your vitamins or medication. Have a siesta fiesta. Take a walk, and don't forget, be Beard. kind to yourself. Beard has all the solutions. Okay. Oh god, that's not right. Yes, you broke the streamer. Okay, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get a sandwich, and then I will come out of the closet. Okay, I have returned. <laughs> Sandwich! Sandwich? Oh god. Alright, I have got the sandwich. Whew. Well, now, now you are forever part of our quote database, Beard. Alright. Uh, well, now I'm out of the closet. Does it feel any different? <laughs> Yay! Okay, well, hey, no zombos is good. Yeah, you do. I've I've been completely blown away by the uh intensity of your your wisdom uh that I saw today on, on Drax's stream as well. Very smart. Such wow. Big brain. Hey you guys! Oh god. Ah, ah. I was like, oh my god, what is that? <laughs> this is like the Langees all over my stream. The Langees. Ow. <laughs> All right, I should can mow. Oh yeah, with the 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 talking hands, man, that thing that creeps me the fuck out. So did I ruin this? Did I did I fuck up spawns on this somehow? Up or down? Wait, wait, wait. wait. That is such. I love that movie, but God, I scared the crap out of me. 
but I had nightmares from Never Ending Story as well. So. Not because of um, the horse. Oh yeah, those are creepy as fuck. No, the thing that got me in um, Never Ending Story was the wolf. Like the big wolf thing in the cave. And for years, um, I would cut, I would get like the, yeah, you, Punky ooh. Pink Cow asked me, how can you afford a single family home on just one minimum wage income? Oh, please, if I had a dollar for every time someone asked me that, I'd actually be able to afford a single family home. <laughs> it's about as possible as SpongeBob passing his boating test. Not in this economy. <laughs> Thank you, Porky. We still haven't watched that, Ali. Yeah, the, so there's like, it was a recurring thing that I would have in these nightmares of like, you know, a cave and then just like seeing the little eyes and the teeth to a point where mum got really pissed off with me because I would just have the nightmare over and over and over again. Ah, uh, Squidward. Oh. Yeah, loot is respawning. Loot shouldn't be respawning. We don't, we don't want re respawning loot. That's, that's too cheaty. Isn't that one of the many things that we have pinned in our Discord chat, Ali? An M14? I mean, I guess if you want to mow a lot of stuff down. Yeah, let me go into the... My server. Oh boy. Server. Sandbox variables. Yeah, <laughs> we've got so many things pinned. Whoopsie. I guess I need to actually eat the sandwich before Flint starts making sploosh sounds at me about that. <laughs> Hi again, Daddy Toth. Hello. Oh, look, why? <sighs> Lip art, please. Oh, you found some fresh cheese? Nice. Um. You have sushi and beer. Oh, the way that this documents thing is where save the cheese. Uh, I believe that's Catalan. I think that's what we figured out last time. Um, Coder, no. I'm getting confused now. The, the the neighborhood watch is going. Cheese is rotting in the freezer, by the way. Mm hmm. Cheese and ice cream. The cheese. Yes, the cheese. Yeah, it, oh, that sounds really good. But that sounds like something I'd do, Ali. Ice cream goes pretty gross. 
like it separates, but it's actually melting in the freezer. Oh, dirty toes. Sorry, I just saw a message. I'm uh, apparently doing a terrible job of multi multitasking today. Uh, Wednesday. Wednesday is birthday. Wednesday is when we move the Sims in. Mm hmm. Yes. Yes, this is a, this is basically is the Sims. I'm so fucking graceful. It's fine. I'm so dis I I'm doing too many things at once. Okay. I'm trying to figure out how to read this text file. Loot respawn equals one. When zero, loot will not respawn in zones that have been visited. Number of hours since an item was dropped. Items will respawn. Oh. Says none. It's supposed to be on none. Oh, well, picking dirt will just have to do. I mean, I would like my birthday to come sooner as well. By 6 p.m., can we help you with that, Beard? Can we give you motivation to, or can we influence you? You want to play all the things. Whoopsie. Yeah, what are the options? Tell us what the options are. Yeah, items were respawned already and already looted containers in towns and trailer parks. Items will not respawn in player made containers. Default none. Loot respawn equals one, which is none. When set to zero. Loot will not respawn in zones that have been visited. Zero. I don't know. As near as I can guess, maybe redoing the zombie. Why, why not? You don't want to spend th three hours of... Oh, fuck me. You want to spend three hours of Arc Roulette waiting to see if it's going to launch or not? It was loud. Hi, Pyro. Yeah, I decided to make it hard. Where? Why was it so loud? Ooh. A Terran flame? I have no idea. Oh, okay. Uh, hmm. I think you should play Medieval Dynasty. Pyro, I need to turn your sound effect down because 
If I hadn't already just had a wee, I think I may possibly have peed myself. Oh, am I? I'm hungry. I'm hungry again. So eat some tortilla chips. Yeah, I'm wondering if maybe re redoing the the zombie behavior, maybe redid reset all the loot tables. I think we've got a good I think I set a, a good balance for this though. Um so we do have respawn, but it's low and slow, like a good brisket. Uh yes, I am playing with mods. Um I don't think I have a command for it. Um, but yeah, the mods are. What are our mods? <laughs> Wait, no, I do. I do. I do have one, right? <laughs> I do. Yes, Punky's a mod. When Ali plays Project Zomboid, I'm playing with mods. Those are what we what we have. So there's nothing like game changing. It's more um, quality of life. It totally counts, Baird. Of course you count. Yeah. So just like comfort things. Ah, uh, baloney. What? Why is there red wine in the fridge? For fuck's sake, people! I don't care if this is the end of the world. Treat your red wine properly. Terrible. Um, there are zombies. Well, because since you've arrived, I've had like nothing but weird, disjointed, unhinged chaos for the last hour. I have no idea what the fuck I'm doing. What? Oh. Oh. What? No. Well, what I'm doing now is <laughs> so much. My God, it so is. What is this? <gasps> There's a keychain on the floor, but with no keys in it. It's terrible. Okay. <laughs> hey, you guys! Oh, hey, Ollie, toast. <laughs> There's other people on the server. What the heck? Did I get to the end of the vlog? We've had some. Oh, Pyro! Hi! Oh my God! Everyone's <gasps> ah! everyone's joining. All right, where where are you guys? Ali and Pyro, you guys are really close to each other. shouldn't be standing out here looking at a map. Yay! Well, see, one nice thing, actually, with if everything's reset, spawn-wise, <laughs> it's, 
Look, and I never fucking swear. Ever. Uh, spaceman. Dirty toes. 100% spaceman. This is the house that I really like this house. Except I can't find the light switch. I'm trying. Look. I don't think there's any in here because I can't hear. But yeah, because everything's respawned, it basically means you all get like a, a fresh... Fresh zombies? Oh, okay, interesting. Okay, that's good to know. Actually, before I fuck around any further, I'm going to go reset that. Hmm, <laughs> fresh zombies. Okay, so... <laughs> oh no, I'm like that when I watch Molly stream this and I'm playing as well. And I'll be like, wait, was... Where did, where did that... Oh god, where did they come from? And it's like, oh... Molly's stream. Me. Um, I. <laughs> it, it's an experience. Punky Pink Cow asked me, What could you prepare with fresh zombie meat? Oh no. Fresh zombie meat. Are you out of your bloody mind? There's not enough seasoning in the world to make that palatable. Stick to cooking the food that doesn't try to eat you back. Again, very succinct and almost polite for Gordon Ramsay. Yeah, so if you really want a good jump scare while you're playing this, follow, go watch Molly's streams because Molly plays this on like apocalypse mode or something of some crazy setting. Um, and there's just these constant sounds. And if you aren't following Molly, you should do it anyway, because if you don't, I'm going to poop in your Wheaties. Um. That is true. Gator tail is quite delicious. Okay. So if you want to make life easier for yourself. Um. Oh. And here, if you find a place that looks comfy, you can right click on a, in a house and uh, hit claim safe house. And then if you die, you will respawn back in that house. Um, and if you want to like move, you can. So, um, or I can just add people. <laughs> what? Oh, thank you, Toast. What a bizarre thing to do. I would have thought tarot would be considered far too liberal. I may or may not have been involved in those things. You know, Fox News is really reaching if they're getting tarot cards on. Also, I can come and pick you all up if you want. I was like, ooh. Disassembling a church sounds like a good thing to do. Um, 
yeah so you can right click to claim a safe house and then if you check view safe house make sure you click this box respawn in safe house and that means that um you'll respawn in the safe house when, when, when that means you'll respawn in the safe house as opposed to in a random location Hi, Toast. I'm just thinking it doesn't show a bunch of names now. I'm like super distracted by this sandwich right now, to be honest. Good job, Beard. Honestly, the, the amount of days off that I've lost because I couldn't figure out what I wanted to play. And then I've not played anything. I've just sat there staring at my screen in frustration. this month as well is there a reason why you're not playing medieval dynasty drags you're just taking a, a break from being dog snacks rabby hmm i think rabby stole my cooking pot Dinners. I think I was playing that one time when you came in last week or oh, week before last and I was just running around in like a medieval place stealing shit I mean uh, borrowing things I think I may have been playing it <laughs> maybe <laughs> It's a fun game. Yeah, look, look, you know, you've got to lean into the to your brand. Um stealing diamonds. Yeah. Oh shit. I've got hiccups. Just compacting the bags a little. But you know what? You can still have fun being sucky at a game. Just ask me how I know. Where did I put it? Oh, we have ants right now. Um, I kind of missed that that was coming up. Uh, so this would be a great time to stand up and stretch and get a coffee and have a wee. 
Um, I will attempt to not do anything interesting for the next few minutes because I feel like I only just got up. I only just get up? I don't know. It is, it is pretty fun, Beard. Oh, I forgot I stole more coffee. Okay. Um, so yeah, if anyone, <coughs> um, Pyro Alley, if you, uh, want me to come and retrieve you and bring you bring you over here hey where did my pen go no no hiccups i don't have hiccups okay where did all my pens go make my way downtown thanks Appreciate that. Wait, really? Thank you for watching, ads. Welcome back. There's still technically 30 seconds left. Oh, that's a tough call. It's rough when you get that. I, I don't know what to tell you. Okay, we did these places again. That one. I'm marking on the map which houses I've emptied, just so I never, so I, I know, until I fuck up and re reset the server somehow. I have a, a bunch of fabric, like rip sheets and uh, denim, denim and leather strips in here, and these boxes, if you need those toast. Okay. I mean, there's only like nine in there, but you're, you're welcome to them. All right, let's get... Let's cook, because I'm hungry. Oh, why, look, why is the chicken... Fr what is going on? I can create a stir fry from peanut butter. But that's all I have for it. A uh, toast in game. Game chat. A little concerned about all this, actually. I'm gonna move all of this stuff into the fridge and just see how much of this is actually still frozen. Uh, can we have that longer, please? Here, like that. Yes, I do have a voice channel, but everyone's doing their own thing right now, so 
which is fine. All right. You're welcome to join. I don't I don't mean to sound like I'm guilting. Are you you don't need to role play in voice. I don't just quietly. I think you'd end up giggling too much. Um, but yes, if you see me in the, oh god, if you see me in this channel, you are welcome to join. In fact, if I'm not in this channel, you're still welcome to join. Well, I don't know what you're talking about. My name's Milton. <laughs> Hi, Pyro. <laughs> Sorry, Milton. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, now there's toast. Look, look, your I'm little thing. Just a humble farmer just coming over to help the city. <laughs> oh god. I need more machetes. Oh hey, god. There's more than one of us role players around here. Oh. Uh, oh god. Okay. Alright. Everything is fine. <laughs> um do you do you do you have a cooking pot in your place, Taurus? I do, and I was just about to bring one over to you. I was just like <laughs> actively regretting choices. It happens sometimes. You did invite us to the server, so I I did, I did. <laughs> <clears throat> yeah, no, it's, it's really fine. I am. The thing is, Torst, I think that you're not that awkward because you fit with everyone else here. Yay! You said we're all just a little bit nervous, by I see. In our own special ways. Our is just special. The neuro spice must flow. Look at you, Bar, just... with your your little stream avatar thingy showing on my my channel. I should charge you for that. Uh, I don't even know what that means. Your little logo for Discord. Yeah, what is that? It's do? showing. Why why is it there? Um, it, no. it it lights up when you talk, Pyro. It's very fancy. Oh, oh, okay. Gotcha. That's cool, yeah. I'm gonna test my freezer to see if my freezer stuff is not freezer burned. I think it's fine. It's just cheese and ice cream apparently decided that they didn't want to be in a solid frozen state. My cheese is still fresh frozen. It says that. The milk is rotten, though. Yeah. But oddly enough, rotten milk is still useful in this game. It is. I tried so hard to save the cheese. Look, you don't understand how hard it is in New Zealand. You're like. I mean, everything is powered by sheep running on giant hamster wheels. Trying to get them to run fast enough to keep the freezer actually at frozen or below is really tough. So you just have to deal with 50 degree ice cream goo. Just, it's just how things go. I'm just having a moment of silence for the cheese. Did it go off? No, but I'm thinking about all the cheese that has rotted in the world. Oh. Why so? Yeah. All right. Bacon. Let's make a bacon and oyster stew. Sounds like something you'd find at Red Lobster. And yet, also, it sounds disgusting. Holy hell, there's a zombie in here. Where is it? Right, Flav? It's very confusing. Time to kill it with a rake. <laughs> God bless America. If only I had my gun. Um, you there, should have a baseball bat in two. your bag. <laughs> Zombies, watch out. They're coming for you. Battle Toast is coming to town. <laughs> I 
I think the Sorry. zombies decided to take a break. That's my murderous clown voice. Pretty sure I'm dead. Maybe. Didn't oh god, I've it. lost oxsters. Lobsters. Lobsters? What the oysters? Oh, you got me confused with red lobster. And now I'm just thinking about biscuits. Look. Cheddar Bay biscuits. Toes. Bacon, yes. Oysters. Veggies. There might be there might be a few zombies back there. There's a pharmacy, it had a bunch of stuff in it, but uh see there was one following you right now mm -hmm. come here little zombie what are you doing come here come here <laughs> uh no i haven't got down that far yet Stu. stream happened i see yeah, they're awake What is the what what are the building colors mean? Different things. <laughs> no, it's too. Um sorry, <laughs> Molly. Um so purple means it's purple and blue oh. means it's blue. Okay, all right. Hi yeah. little zombie, let's play catch the machete. Oh, better luck next time. Um, I think green is just like retail. I think yellow are like food and beverage type places. I can't remember one of them what is the like other municipal, ones are. right? Like it's like a hospital or like a police station, I think. Like, maybe? I just don't remember the colors I haven't played in so long. It, it, look, look, blue things. It's oh, not God, as easy something. to stream as as you think it is. Okay, there we go. Why, That's why I does... haven't done that yet? Surely, bacon should add more than ten points to a stew. <laughs> I'm sorry you scared your wife, stew. Stu has a really good sound effect that he makes when he gets jump scares as well. She's livid. Oh no. Sorry, Stu's wife. Okay. Got a few zombies that were chasing Pyro. Although chase might be a strong word since they don't move very fast. <laughs> Plum, how do you even remember that? Yes, Arg Norman Gurgle. Yeah, I I got like a few houses down and then I went down the side and then my existence stuff happened. <laughs> it's all you've got left roll. Oh dear. What was that even from? I remember. <laughs> God damn, I won the jackpot. Just found a car. Well, you still have to find the keys for it. Well, I already got them. I'm driving. I think I think I did find a few cars that I parked on the side of the road that I left the keys in. I see you're collecting cars with trailers now. It just seemed like the logical next progression from keys. And I just got in the old Gigamart truck. I don't or even reliable. know. I was just like, this could be useful. I should take it. At what point am I going to be able to drive three cars at the same time? I'm going to oh be my. like the Jay Leno of the server. 
I see Pyro driving. Oh god. Seems okay so far. Well, first of all, I'm an old man, so I took the slow driver thing. Okay. You are an old man. Old I can confirm RP this. Build here, okay. Oh, you mean RP? Yeah, yeah, that too. <laughs> Both, yeah. <laughs> in, in and out of, of, of game. Uh -huh. <laughs> I actually built this character to be a parody of Richard Simmons named Simon Richards. So kind of like Simon's Fitness Club, those tapes that you see around. Mm -hmm. So he's a fitness instructor, but he does have a little secret that he does smoke. He just never lets anyone know about it. But he's also very body positive anyway, just wants people to be the best they can be. But it's a very different world out there. How do you tell if a house is like claimed, essentially? Like, I don't want to take somebody else's spot. <laughs> Um, at this point, I wouldn't worry about it too much. Um, Mine's kind of so obvious. The inside the, looks the, like an episode of Hoarders. Yeah, it does. Uh, the the two there are, are open. Um, the end. Yeah, that you're at. Ravi's got one down behind me, but this has some good space on the side for props. So yeah, just making sure. Okay. I mean, there's there's no obligation to stick around this location is just a real because she's put some effort into like enclose it so yeah, it's no, that's great you know. Stu's place um, is awesome if you ever visit it it's nearby it looks like a fortress I will check it out some on the other end of this row I can't, I'm not entirely sure which is the place that Ravi's claimed um, but you can right click on the floor and claim safe house and I'm assuming if someone else has claimed it, it won't let you do it, so... Um... Also, there's some stew on the counter in my place. Like, the edible type, not actually stew, who's not the angry wife. The beardless wife. stew. Yeah, there's a beardless stew on the kitchen counter. Right, I'll be... I'll be right back. I got my safe house, so... Although I guess if right. I stay, if I AFK, I could get killed. Uh, so I no, you'll be I fine there. Should be okay. I mean, it's a good, a good habit to get out to to log out, but you'll be fine where you are. I should eat before I go. Yeah, I'll be right back. <laughs> be the best that you can be. <clears throat> yeah. Game, please. What are you doing? Oh, oh, all right. You want to drive the school bus? Do it. Does it have gas? Is it functional? Need anybody to hotwire it? Yeah, I'm like, I can hotwire it. Oh, I didn't know which place Pyro picked. Oh, I'm not sure either. Okay. Gotta drop off a care package. The driving is a bit like tank controls. Why didn't I just pick up? Oh my god. What am I doing? Why am I doing it this way? Now that's a very good point, Flam. Zombies would argue the point that bearded stew isn't edible. All right, care package deposited. After opening every fucking door. But my little dude's so depressed. I'm not depressed. Not yet. 
sad, bored, hungry, need to smoke, and thus sweaty. It's basically like living in Florida. Oh, I need more cigarettes. I'm gonna drop a bag off for Pyro. All right. Have you had a yeah, chance to read your bag yet? No. No, I don't have an Alice one. I have the, the large backpack. Oh, that one's upgradable. Oh. <laughs> Thanks. Am I hungry already? Look, everything requires a little bit of maintenance, all right? Have fun working. In fact, I just got a level in tailoring. I can upgrade these to tier two now. Oh, nice. I really, really love that they consider butter and margarine spice. Apparently, the upgraded large backpack turns into an Alice pack. Oh, okay, interesting. I didn't realize it till I did it. Uh, that makes sense, though. That means you got like a smooth progression. Ali, there's no road rolls. So other than, you know, don't crash into other people, but through the ass is fair game. Do you have any more thread by any chance? Yes, I do. Favorite. Ooh, I'm going to go read a tailoring book real quick. I love the fast learner perk. I think I'm going to have to actually go loot, loot for food now. We've got a, more people in here. Also might need to start setting up a garden before winter hits. Mm. Like I said, I've got a bunch of seeds and some fertilizer and a few tools. orange cat looking at me <gasps> so a while ago we had like a little orange kitten it cost me in the front yard and I fell in love with it and then I didn't see it for ages and then last week Daisy was going batshit and we opened the door and there was a, a ginger cat sitting out by our car not at all concerned about the dog and the second I step towards him he starts like telling me a story like this is like the most vocal cat I've come across and I get near him and he just like flops down on the ground and was just like okay you can love me now and I'm just like oh my heart it's like is the cat distribution system at work here could be <laughs> similar to how I got my eldest orange cat I mean, we can't yeah. take on another cat, but 
and he's popped around a couple of times. I've named him Ambrosius. Which is, I don't know, a name. <laughs> you want to, oh, right. The, um. <sighs> that Instagram of the, the lady just like, Urgh! cute aggression hugging the cow is the best. To fit the water. I'm going to rip some clothes to get even more thread so I can finish upgrading these bags to tier three. Oh. oh, I've got five more here. Oh, you have more thread? Perfect. Yeah, I've got five more thread. I don't know how much you need. But... I will probably grab all the thread so I can upgrade all these bags. Oop. Thank you. Yep, you're welcome. All the things. First time I met Saxon, he literally jumped in my car twice. And then after I got him on my car the second time, he parked himself behind my car and hollered at me and would not let me leave the parking lot. <laughs> That's amazing. So when it's I like... ended up letting him in, he just sat in the passenger seat and purred the entire time on the way home. He He's was like, not no, you, freaked out. you don't understand. You're my human now. Do you need an upgrade? Yes, please. Ooh. All right. Oh. I don't know why I have those marked. You can also use two of them for water bottles. Yes. That's going to make such a difference. Oh, except you need the aqua bottles to do that. Um, other bottles should work too. No, it ain't letting me put like a normal water bottle there. But that's okay, that's still better. Oh, no. I'm gonna test that. <laughs> Hello, I have... Technotone! Canteen should work too, and shows, so should the gym bottles. I'm like, oh man, there's so many, so many buttons now. Hello, pretty pretty. Hello. Wait, isn't there a... Uh... Yeah, there is. I knew there was a flashlight slot. Oh, now I have to get a balloon. Yep. Uh, wasn't there a glow stick? Hello. Hi! Yeah. Hello! Oh, maybe. Is it only when it's active? It's attached. I see it. Huh. Oh, certain certain hooks only work for certain areas. Yeah. And some things you might need to make a carabiner for, but I'm not entirely sure. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. I remember that. Yes, have fun with the point redemptions. That is exactly what they are for. And someone needs to come and empty out trash. Look at all these. 
But it's bugs. I think this is Ravi. Ravi's been doing a lot of foraging. And apparently doesn't want to eat the bugs that she finds. Wait, can the bugs be used for... Um... Compost? Not sure, but I think they might be able to be used as fishing bait. Okay. Alright, let's... Um... Oh, I have something for you. I was like, ooh, is it edible? <gasps> it's purple. Oh, it's pink! Perfect. Thank you. Hey. Oh, it looks like I've got Pepto now. <laughs> Delicious. I've got Gatorade and Pepto on my back. Also, I might have one more thing to give you. Oh. Not as pretty, but it's something. I've, I've been walking around with one water bottle. <laughs> Going from that to three, that's a lot. Thank you. Oh, with the water bottles, you have to make them a backpack attachable item first. Then you can attach it. Oh, okay. Um, all right, well, let me go fill up all my water bottles. I, I feel like I need to go and check out Stu's place for, for zombies now, but it's probably also uh, a little bit late now that he's already woken up his wife. Mm. Mm. what it's worth, it's kind of cool to look at. Yeah, I haven't been down there in a while. I'm going to be nosy. I got jelly. It's kind of fun seeing how everyone's just like, psh, spreading out. But yeah, Ravi's here, Stu's down here. Oh, that's right, I was gonna put notes on places so I remembered whose was whose. I think that was Ravi's house. I think I need a smaller font. Or I'm gonna have to do like a list down the side. It's my house. I'm gonna laugh if Pyro comes back dead. I mean, it would be terrible and very, very sad. Why do we have a handful? better than a tow fork. Maybe.
It's so dark. I'm gonna read that. Oh, I already have that one, I think. see zombies even if they're dead ones and toes are here for them and she's like she's done some real heavy lifting here with all the uh breaking stuff down why are why are stairs so hard That's better. These pretty rugs. Just like walking into a dark room without having my weapon out, it's fine. I'm relying I'm very, <laughs> relying very, very heavily on audio cues. I'm still unloading my truck from yesterday. Oh god. it's so dark because there's no sky light skylight it's called the sun dell fuck's sake there's no sky <laughs> there's no skylight thing big ball of light light sky thing ball I feel like this maybe is is like closing the, the barn door, but take these places anyway. Friends, well, I'm safe for zombies today. I done got none brain. All out of brain. Well, these dresses are so pretty. Big round dresses. I feel like I need to go through. Whoopsie. Oh no, my glasses! In my hat! Not my glasses. I can't see without my glasses. All right, I didn't lose. I I didn't hurt myself. Oh good. Oops. It wasn't very graceful. 
Yeah, I feel like because I I messed up the spawns that I, I really ought to go through and make sure everyone's places are empty. I did check yours twice and I think Ravi checked yours as well. Oh good. I kind of wondered if it would have been better just like manually spawn like some little stuff sprinkled all throughout the map or something. Well, I mean, possibly, but then that's something that I'd have to keep on doing. Yeah, it'd be a little time consuming as well. And then it turns the server into work. My other thought and... too is I wonder what the other towns look like. But yeah, this, I mean, this I think will work out well for us. Um, it's not like... What I did wasn't a big change, but it should just give us... Oh yeah, I see it, like... S -s spiced mayo levels of interest. So just a little bit of, you know, entertainment and... A little bit of pushback, rather than... I just had nothing sushi at all. with spicy mayo. <laughs> Every time I see that now, it's like, it's the buck, my parrot. How do I get down oh, here? I'm pretty sure this is fine. Stu so probably realized that I hadn't done anything and went around and cleared everything afterwards. But yeah, this just means that like if we haven't been in an area for a week, they'll slowly start respawning. But it won't be like at a ridiculous rate. I'll be like, well, Stu, looks like everything's clear. And he'll be like, yeah, I know. I checked already. Thanks, doll. These places have got two back doors. That's fancy. Oh, no, don't do that. his fancy gate wall thing that he's got. What's the hot key for torch light? Oh, whoops. F. Oh, yes. I was like, I was about to make some smile talking about, oh, yeah, F for uh, uh, flashlight? Whatever. Alright, I'm being nosy now. Oh wow. This place is awesome. It's definitely a place to get peanut butter jelly over. And it looks like he- yeah, he, it's a scratch build. <laughs> he told me he was gonna He's build so, a two-car garage. So creative. Oh, look at his garden. Hey. Everybody's so creative. He's got a, an arcade machine.
barbarian in comparison. I'm so nosy. Nosy. Nice place you got here, Stu. Oh my lord. All these shelves. Yes. Yeah, and we're just like storing stuff in cardboard boxes and on the floor. For what it's worth, I'm just doing that because I'm lazy. <laughs> the floor is just the world's largest shelf. Okay, so he either made a bar or there was a bar here already. I'm pretty sure he made this bar. Bourbon, white wine, and red wine. And it's just so cool. Uh huh. Well, I like those boxes. He's already got the genery going. Win. I can't remember how those work. Just that it's a thing. Did I finish that smoke? I think I did. Oh wait, I started sprinting. So you know, no, I didn't. Apparently, you can't sprint and smoke at the same time. That seems bullshit. All right, so let's. Okay, so that's like Stu's little... I wish I could just... draw and a little like... line to show... I suppose I could just use the arrows, right? Stu's little, little compound. Oh. What time is it? Is the skylight coming up soon? 3.30. Yes, soon. So what's our pro? Oh, I probably still need to clear out those other houses, actually. Is that last row of houses to the south of us? And then... Wait. I was like, is this my house? Yes, it's got some bingos in front of it. Maybe time to start doing some food accumulation.
It's really interesting how the my, the mini map shows your markings, but not people. I need to set up some sort of like Bamery type setting here. I think you can. It's not not my uh, not my style. Doesn't sound great. I'm pretty excited that I've got a bottle of Pepto. I feel like. 40 year old me in the 40 in the zombie apocalypse would be like you know what food bandages i don't give a fuck pepto yeah i'm gonna need that yeah <laughs> fucking jackpot nothing worse than trying to have to deal with zombies when you've got a heartburn oh hey i just realized that the um that condition the mod that we've got that shows condition of things shows when the bottles start getting empty. Oh yeah. Um actually I thought that was a vanilla feature. Nope. Oh. Remaining. Cause the water bottles show that too. Oh, did I just start making no, oh, I don't wanna make soup. Yes, we're making soup now. <laughs> Salmon and fresh shrimp soup. Sounds awful. Like, it doesn't sound great at all. Hmm. Salmon, shrimp, and canned tomato soup. Delicious. I need to make sure I take my next break. I move because I didn't last time. I definitely need to get some carpentry stuff done so I can get some organization set up here. Same. Such bubbling. <laughs> like, or on ground. That's a great idea. Mm. Oh, that is, that is a sound. There's some, <laughs> ooh, yeah, midnight, go, go get some sleep. There's some soup on the counter in the kitchen. Yay. Good night, Tarn. Oh, hey, a generator has appeared. Yes, I started sprinkling the map with generators. All right. I am going to take. Truck. I'm like, hmm, which truck shall I take? I'm going to take this truck and I'm going to go. Oh. 
What? I'm reversing with a trailer? Hello? Kind of. It's fine. That was so good. It's, it's, the truck is so loud. Look, Mom, I'm driving! Ugh. Oh! Don't crash into the gate. So we may need to do like a second gate at each entrance just for extra safety. Uh, no, other way. The other right. Hey you guys! Oh, I just realized. Maybe. Oh, there we go. That's what I wanted to do. Like, why would you use keys when you can just hotwire every vehicle? And then you need to never need to worry about keys again. You can just have them as decoration items. There we go. Wouldn't it be really cute if you could use the flags on the mailboxes? So like if you put stuff in the mailboxes, the little flags would go up. That would be cute. Oh, I got candy. Oh, that's where all that stuff went. Hey. Hello, is anyone home? Oh man, I'm just being so careless with this. I ought to pay more attention. Oh, oh, that scared me. All right, ads popping in 30 seconds. So you should all get up and stretch and take a break. And get a coffee and a wee. Uh, ah! Oh no, you waited just as the ad started. Mix nuts, hello. Hi. Uh, hello. Lit butt, please. Welcome. I'm so sorry that you arrived like literally the second. Um, I don't, I don't know if you're behind the the uh the ad wall or not um i'll just i'll just wait until it, the ads are done it wasn't much okay that's good all right mixed nuts thank you so much for the raid i appreciate it very much <laughs> um welcome in i'm deloria my pronouns are she her um currently just emptying uh, re-clearing some houses because i reset the zombies on our server 
I hope you had a lovely stream. What were you working on? Any uh, particular project? All this music is just well, it, weird and silly. All right. Let's get some beard. We had a, a couple of people join the server today and all of a sudden I'm like, oh boy. Seven hours worth of modded PZ. What is CDDA? It sounds pretty badass, but I genuinely have no idea what it is. We're, um, we're, we're lightly modded. <gasps> oh, chocolate chips. Maybe we can make chocolate chip pancakes. Oh yeah? Ooh. Oh, okay. You know what? I'm gonna eat that. I'm gonna eat that stale yogurt. Delicious. Stu headlights on. Front roll. Fortunately, his battery I'm, is still good. I'm surprised he's still on, actually. I was just checking his car to see if it was doing okay. Uh oh. See if it needed any f tweaking. Fire is not in game. Hopefully he logged out. Don't see him. Mm -hmm. He has right. some window work that needs done, but otherwise not that bad. You're gonna need that Pepto. Uh, based on another super hard zombies. Oh, okay. You start six months into the apocalypse, drunk. Wait, oh my god. So, like. Dang, that's intense. <laughs> it sounds. You started. Okay. <laughs> like I, I'm like. I'm the I'm the I'm the girl who goes easy mode. <laughs> um, that sounds amazing. I love that people can play on play this and like the way that they want you can sort of massage the game with mods and settings to make it fit molly that sounds right up your alley <laughs> like oh it's insanely hard i bet molly would like that Actually, what I'm going to do is that. No, don't eat it. For fuck's sake, I just ate a bullion cube. That's got to be revolting and very salty. I have like nothing but. Mmm, <laughs> delicious. I have actually Yum. eaten bullion cubes by themselves before. Like, I, I've... Oh, no. Eating a whole jar of mayo. Oh, that sounds terrible. All right, where's the freezer? No, I could get behind the bowl of the butter. I could absolutely manage the butter. No, stop it. Stop. I was one of those weird kids that would literally take bites out of the butter. Yes, it doesn't seem like much is. <laughs> hey. Yeah, I used to. <laughs> I genuinely had my mum concerned that we had mice in the house because I would like nibble on the corner of packets of stuff. So like the brown sugar bag, 
I would like nibble the corner off and then like sneak some sugar out from the corner of like brown sugar and the icing sugar and stuff. Um, and she thought we had mice and then I did it to a block of cheese in the fridge. And in my six year old wisdom, my granddad told me this many times. In my, my six year old wisdom, when mum said what happened to the cheese, I tried to say mice. Um, I didn't, it didn't track. It didn't fly at all. So not fair. I thought it was very inventive, but apparently not. You never know. Mice in New Zealand could be different. I feel like I should leave something behind. Ooh, a juice box. Hmm. Will a juice box make me un make me happy? A juice box would make me happy. Hmm. Especially like the slope when you get like the last corner. All right. So what I'm my, well, what I'm figuring here. Ugh. Not the perishables. Uh, wait, which side do I get in? Are you toast you chatting with Stu in local chat? Oh, hello. Yeah. Hey buddy. Ooh, that is humble. Look, I just want to put stuff in the freezer. You don't mind. Meanwhile, just a certain want... orange chubby boy is blocking my screen. I get all of that stuff. All right. Figure I'll just like move the frozen stuff like from from house to house onto the freezer until I'm ready to go back. Oh, booze. That'd be a good idea. Oh, do we have? Here we go. A crossword. That's going to make me happy. Pyro, did you die or did you just log out? Okay. That makes sense. Those socks aren't going to collect themselves, you know. Hello. And I'm not collecting them for you. I'm not being seduced by other loot right now. Oh, this was a house with the uh, the couple that got caught out. Why is that there? Oh. Well, 
Oh, I'm drunk. It's fine. I can walk real good. Ooh. I mean, I've... Oh, whoops. I've had bullion... Like, I've had, like... Bullion is tea. Like a hot tea. Like beef tea. And that's pretty good. But I imagine... Pyro, you'd know, since you've done both, that it would be kind of like Marmite, wouldn't it? With in terms of it, like how salty it is. Pyro ate, ate a massive spoonful of Marmite and it was so fun to watch. I thoroughly enjoyed that. Oh, whoops. And if you don't know what Marmite is, you're probably considered lucky by quite a few people in the world. I love it. I think it is delicious. So that place, oh, this one still has frozens. Um, what can we use to... Here, that's like a snowflake. So it's a cool house? Yeah. I haven't been checking the yards, but I'll do that on the way back out. Hello? I think I can hear someone, but I'm not sure. Ah! Oh, that's from yesterday. Hey, buddy! Ooh, honey! Yeah, no, that's one I picked up. Uh, wait, no, I should clear first before I start looting. One that I picked up yesterday. I think that may have been the one that Ali spotted. I really like the houses on this side of the street. Oh, chair. No, I'm going, I'm try, still trying to go through and clear some of the houses near where we, we are. It's like, really? I feel guilty that all of a sudden there's more like zombos again. It is a zombie game, you're right. Nothing there. That's just how my brain works.
<laughs> well, I mean, there's no reason you can't do both. That's amazing. Like that I seem to be putting things into storage pretty quickly. Drumsticks. Makes me want snacks. I guess it was a good thing Flint made me go get a sandwich. Oh, we got company. Hello. Hello. get a jump scare whatever fire I don't think I can hear anyone else I love that there's bourbon in the bathroom here Was this a survivor house? It must be, with there being canned food in the bathroom. And also, you know, with the black electric guitar, because you've always got to be prepared. A shortbread cookie dough does not require eggs. Ah, huh. curious. Would think it would at least require egg yolks. Checked everything in here, right? I'm only going to do this row of houses. I think that's going to give us plenty of food for a while. <gasps> Tomato paste, yes. Now we can make salads. Delicious. You know what? Yes, I'm going to take those. All right. Poor characters like stop losing the food and start eating it, please. Oh, 
Oh, you're still going. Jeez. Oh, I did it again. I skipped my ad break, didn't I? I told everyone to go sit down and take or stand up and take a break, and I didn't do it in the car. I get so absorbed in what I'm doing. That's not what I wanted to do. This is what I want. Uh. This is my house that I haven't claimed, but I keep telling everyone it's my house. I knew it was meant to be because it had a, a frozen pizza. Hello? You went home? Well, sorry, it has a, fold a laundry room, which I kind of love with a folding table. And a combination washer and dryer. I'm watching with the Dog Goblin series. just pants those pants are pants all right this house is clear so dry goods first and tea. I haven't seen any coolers. When we were playing last time, we there were like a bunch of coolers that we picked up and we found out that they actually worked. Yeah, I think we found them like on the side of highways or at campgrounds. So we might have to like check out like that little valley station entry into Louisville thing mm. or check out an army supply store. Those are really good for food looting. I think it's going to fit. Yeah, if we could come across those, it'd be great. This one, or was it? No, it was this one. Oh, you don't have a dryer there? That's rough. I don't know, I kind of 
like back home i i didn't have a dry well i had a dryer but i didn't really use it i had a um <laughs> liz bob i had a like a clothes drying frame and i kind of loved it because i'd set it up near my heater like not close obviously because it's not safe but i sort of set up heat it near the heater and then wake up and everything would just smell like fresh laundry in the morning and I just put on my clothes to dry them like I put everything on coat hangers so it would dry with gravity and then it would just be like ready to hang up straight away where I live the humidity is really high so yeah it wouldn't dry it, yeah We've had a couple of times where we've had washing machine or dryer issues here, and it's a fucking nightmare. Usually, it, one of the it usually happens after I've done like a load of towels. My initial reaction would be you could just put things in the microwave but maybe maybe not it's a thought but it would depend on the item that was some fantastic parking i am never going to be able to get out of there Oh god. Here, there you go. Well, you're just gonna have to put everything in the oven. I'm making cookies. I'm wishing I had more baking trays. Oddly enough, in this game, cookies don't expire. That, that's right. Um. Well. I guess I have to eat this pizza. What the heck? Bacon, cheese, and eggplant pizza. Sure, you know why? This is going to be one hell of a pizza. I guess. No, you're right, because like. Like we had a, a vegetarian pizza the other day that was. At the base instead of a sauce, it was baba ganoush on the bottom. And that was really fucking good. Oh my God, that sounds amazing. It was. It was just it was baba ganoush. Um, black olives and like feta crumble and I, I don't think there was anything else on there it was just so good making some chocolate chip cookies don't play project zomboid slay zombies <laughs> bake cookies <laughs> Yeah, it's like I haven't really done much zombie biffing today. It's just been like house shopping, 
food shopping, storing, organizing my inventory. Welcome to the Project Zomboid cooking show. Holy crap. This pizza has minus 197 hunger. Wah. Probably if you eat the whole pizza, though. How else would you eat it? In slices. Why would you do that? We I mean, can just like. No, don't put it on the floor. <laughs> it's it's okay. fine. Poor pizza. No one saw that. It's fine. Oh, I don't have my machete handy. The floor is just the world's largest shelf. <laughs> this is look. It, that is me. I am so fucking classy. Hang on, let me let me go to my garage and I'll find a machete that I can use to slice the pizza. Oh, what about a garden saw? That might work. Here we go. There's an axe. I have some knives if needed. <laughs> I, there we go. I got it. Oh my god, you could really slice a pizza with a machete. Yeah. That's awesome. Who wants floor machete pizza? I do. Mmm, delicious. Mine just suited your hunger in one slice. Fine, whatever. If that doesn't perk out my mood, there we go. Machete I'm, pizza. I'm pretty sure the machete doesn't have zombie guts on it. But I'm not totally sure. Did I turn the oven off? I did. No worries. <laughs> Toast is doing the pizza dance. <sighs> so that reminds me, I need to wash my baseball bat. Should probably wash my machete. Oh yeah, me too. I gotta get the, gotta get the cheese off it. I gotta get the um ketchup off of it. Oh, apparently mine doesn't have. <laughs> I I think it's a pretty good one. Apparently my machete is so sharp it didn't actually get cheese on the blade, so it's fine. All right. Oh, I should probably put that oh, the rest of the pizza in the fridge. Could we? Could we maybe have? I was hoping I could just move the pizza straight to the fridge. It's fine. Oh, I still have to go and un oh, oh. Gonna be a move. Unload all the food from the trailer. See any pounds? Kilos? I don't know what the young whippersnappers got some seed for me. I do actually. I got Stop seeds, the farm. seeds and fertilizer. Uh, there's some pizza in the fridge. If you can handle that with your gums. I'm <laughs> yes. <laughs> if I can handle it with my gums, wow, that's rude. Yeah, that's just rude. 
I know, no respect. People got no respect for their elders nowadays. <laughs> um, but yeah, one of these shelves in here is just full of gardening materials, gardening supplies. I don't know why I decided to pizza. Do this. Ah. Hmm? I don't know why I decided Battletoad should have like the killer clown voice. I mean, why not? <laughs> I guess. <laughs> All right. What I want to do here. I'm gonna have to find a tractor, just for like the whole setup, you know. Hmm. Uh-huh. Are these seeds in your kitchen or in the garage? The seeds are in the garage. In here. It's the bathroom. So Still bathroom. gonna find seeds in the air. And one <laughs> of these shelves. Kind of seeds. <laughs> yeah. Also in your house on your dining table there's a little pink bag. Don't the worry, welcome already, gift. Yeah, I've already okay. picked it all up. Um, but yeah, help yourself to anything in here if you need like you guys bored? Shoes, I read some books. That didn't help. Is that is that a problem? Books aren't good for not being bored. Depends on the book. Yeah, skill books was, are good for. Books. Yeah. Yeah, if it's a learning book, then no, they're not entertaining. But there's like uh, comics okay. and crosswords and magazines. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. I bring you oh. some seeds that I have. Seeds, yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna see and, how hard this is. And a watering <laughs> I'm can. Mess with it. Okay. Cool. Thank you. I'm, and I'm also uh, adept need. at fishing if if I can find a place to do that. Oh, well, I also got, got a, you a trowel. Thank you. We have bulks, which I think are good for fish yeah, bait. some worms as well, yeah. which apparently well, of don't... Of course you've uh, got worms. It doesn't surprise me. In my garage, I do have a fishing rod, some fishing line, and some fishing tackles. There's a little fishing shop on the other side of town. I partially raided it, but left stuff I, for other people. I think I grabbed some of the stuff out of there, like some nets and some, uh, I don't know, some other things. I didn't find Direct a fishing rod in there, but I mean, yeah. directly oh, north yeah. of us is a river. So you okay, can and cool. yeah. I think I might have some. Let me see if I have any angler. Ma yeah, I have angler magazines, too, to help with mm. like uh, for making a fishing rod and for I tell my skills a fishing net. Button. Um, yeah, fishing magazines is what I was mentioning and too. And also, we have some exposure survival tapes. Ooh. And Stu has some tapes too. I also have some amongst the piles. Well, the tapes I've been mostly keeping for sure in the bookshelf. I figured I really didn't want those getting lost. But yeah, um, I've been meaning to build bookshelves. I'm just lazy. Well, I learned, I guess, so I read the book for cooking and for trapping, but obviously I don't, like, there's no XP, it's just unlocked, so do I, do I have to do those skills to actually level it at that point? Um, Is yeah. That... If you read the books, they give you an experience boost. Okay. So then, if you watch a video or you do the thing, you get more we experience. Have, we have episodes of The Cook Show over here that can help you with cooking and let me see i think i have an exposure to survival that might help you with fishing i actually have one i have a couple that help with fishing is that, one that helps with traffic yeah it's at my place okay Let's find my chips well there's also well, pizza on the fridge here like honestly pizza i just made it it's mm -hmm. Your poison pizza? You're trying to poison me? It's floor pizza. It's fucking delicious. <laughs> I'm just baking cookies. Ooh. It, is there livestock? Can you uh, do livestock or no? That's a mod, isn't it? Mod currently but they're working on it for build 42, so nice. not yet. Yeah, I think I remember us putting a mod in that added like animals or something. I can't remember last time I played this. I can barely manage to take care of myself, let alone something else. But then like if you had 
chickens or cows, you can make like milk and eggs and all that stuff. You know? Milk yeah. doesn't come from that chickens. Means... What are you talking yeah, about? Get a cheese back, yeah. Cheese. Cheese. Have one. Eat one. Oh, um, I don't know if you guys have been keeping an eye on the Epic Game Store, but they're doing a bunch of. Actually, I think today might be the last one. Free games, but today's free game is Marvel Guardians of the Galaxy. Mm. Um, should definitely. It looks like you need a handyman. Look at all these wall repairs that need to happen. Oh, get to it. Is that from zombies? Just nope. Beating That's on the just walls, essentially. Just time. It's oh, been okay. two two months. And apparently the world is already falling apart. <laughs> Which it, it seems a little, you know, a little excessive. Wait, where did they come from? Oh, wait, that... Wait, wait. Game, please. I have to, if I remember... Oh, there's another worm. Found a worm. This is mine. You're so good at this game. I'm so good, you know, if you ever need worms, I got them. <laughs> right. Oh, God. Oh, God. What have you done? I found, uh, <laughs> I found Toast House. Definitely looks yeah. like the hoarder lives here. I mean, Toast, they, they did say that. I know. <laughs> Let's look through these piles of magazines. <laughs> and see if I can find what I'm looking for. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> this is how you, this is the entrapment. You catch people searching through your piles of uh, stuff. And then You'll you never leave now. <laughs> well, let's see. <laughs> okay, so like Carpentry Volume One is is just the XP boost, but then you say yep. there's tapes too, right? Uh, yeah, yeah. There's a there is an actual bookshelf by the TV. Oh, that has your books on tape. Yeah, so you basically read Carpentry Volume One, and then potentially watch a Carpentry video. And if you keep an eye on your skills, you'll see that you stop having little right hand arrows. And that means you need to read the next book to keep on getting an experience boost. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Oh my gosh, just bored, so I have to figure out how to give them some entertainment. Oh, the tapes help with boredom too. Cool. Okay, that's good then. How come there's not a mod where there's like giant bees in here? You know. Maybe you there is, and you just bees. haven't found it. Look, I had to download all those dumb mods. There wasn't a B one, okay? They are not dumb mods. You take that back. <laughs> you should see the horse mod. Oh, no. God. That sounds terrible. <laughs> it was just, a just joke. Way you said it, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, okay. okay. It's so horrible, but yet hilarious. Just using up a dozen eggs. Trying to figure out how to organize cupboards and cupboards of food. Must bake cookies. Cookies don't expire. You know, if we got all the ingredients, we should be able to make our own pancake mix because you can IRL just make pancake mix. Okay, so I'm not sure any of us are experts at 
out of game, but in game, how do I fix depression? Yes. Um, is your character a smoker? <clears throat> or like something? No. Like no. Okay. Um, there's antidepressants, <laughs> certain foods like chocolate, um, candy. Come, come Actually, here. I got some pills oh, for you. I, ha I have a cure for you. You're making Hold cookies. On. I was gonna you say. Got some cookies? <laughs> yes, I do. I have cookies. It's like okay, I, I got so, some drugs uh, too. Right. So I guess it does work how it works in real life. I just stuff my face with sweets. All right. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. I Would believe like peanut butter is like the ultimate mm -hmm. cure for depression. Would you like chocolate chip, shortbread? Oh, yeah. I'll take chocolate chip, please. That is amazing. Apple four. Three cookies. Oh, my God. There's, they were all over the <laughs> cookies the best. Well, there is kind of a trade thing that's possible in the game but it's kind of annoying yeah, so yeah it's, it's easier faster. to drop yeah, yeah. <laughs> hmm i was like super i'm gonna have to eat a second here perfect that hit the spot oh good glad we don't have any milk we have some rotten milks. milk. Yeah. <laughs> There's probably some spoiled milk in this trash can out here. Yeah. Oh no, we save we save the milk. Even when it's rotten, it's good for treating bug infestations on your plants. Oh, that's cool. I didn't. I don't know. So. Oh wait. Just found some VHSs on the floor. Wait, where was that? Oh. Oh god, there's more. So if it has a question mark, it means I haven't read it or watched it or whatever? Yep. Right. But like, if I try to watch the same video or book for entertainment, it doesn't work, I'm guessing? Am I bored of it? Yeah, you do run the potential of getting bored of it. Yeah. In a way, my character is a bit deranged. I kind of live in a hoarded house full of scattered stuff, and their fridge is full of cookies. <laughs> that sounds perfectly fine to me. And they collect machetes. Always one. We actually eat keys. Rotten food's useful for compost as well, I think. Well, that's how you get worms. I'm not entirely sure on that stuff. The TV in here works, so you can watch the tapes here. Oh, I appreciate it. I did come over back to my house, which I guess has working TV, maybe? Probably. Oh, yeah. Nice. Just make sure to return the video when you're done with it. And rewind it, because you'll get fined. I may have accumulated a fair amount of coffee. Okay. Uh, power source is actually just normal electricity right now, right? Yeah. It goes away after a certain amount of time. Yeah, it should be... In a couple of months, I think. It's like sometime between six to 12 months, we'll lose water and electricity. It's a pretty wide window. Stu already has everything set up. That's what I was going to say. I got to start like. Stu, I think. Water collectors and all kinds of stuff. Yeah, he came from a hardcore server, so he's kind of already used to it. He knows. I... I know the server, this one has a lot of leeway, so I'm not as worried about it at the moment. 
I like things in Kirby mode. Yeah, it's a little less stressful. It's fine. Well, it helps playing things in easy mode when all this, when stream decides that they all want to kick off. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. True. It also helps whenever you play like five different games a week. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Or if you have an otherwise busy schedule. Yep. Frickin' adulting. Okay, did I find... Oh. Uh, yes? No? Oh, wait, glasses. Love the parodies with the video titles. I love that I'm walking around with this keychain with 25 keys on it, but there's no encumbrance. And I don't. You think you would like jingle? make some sort of noise with that but apparently not yeah it's a bit unrealistic I honestly my immersion is ruined my earrings are Knocking somewhere, Pyro? My what? Oh, yeah, I knocked earlier at your house because I was not going to just enter. But... Oh, I didn't see or hear it. Oops, sorry. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> I was like, ah, it's fine. All I hear is the sounds of the undead. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Welcome to my server, Pyro. <laughs> oh, God. It's fine. Okay, my kitchen is a lot better stocked now. So hopefully what I... Oh, I can feel something fit in there. Hopefully what we've got set up for respawns will be comfy for everyone. I think it'll work. How many little tote bags I've got left? Something over five. Oh my gosh, there's fifty in here. Do the seeds go bad? See a timer on them. Yeah, so I think we're okay. There's 50 in one bag. Go pee, bro. So I have farming three, so I already know both, I guess. Uh, sure? Recipe, I guess, if we need to end up making stuff to keep the crops alive. Um, There might be a farming magazine. Yeah, that's apparently that teaches it to you, right? I just start with it because I took the 
farming thing, I guess. Oh, okay. I was gonna say we might have the magazine or not. I just found a spray can in my thing and gave you a water bottle. I didn't know if you had one. Uh, I think I started with one, but I'll take an extra. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't hurt to have a backup in this game. Why do I do this? I'm tempted to raid the school nearby to see if we can find more water bottles. Well, it's true. Good idea. He's kind of wandering the neighborhood. It makes no sense. Arch, arch. I steal a slice of pizza? Yeah, go for it. Off I go to school now. Hey guys! Hey. Don't get caught! Alright, it's in little tote bags in the garage and each of them's got like a different thing in them and I've put the welcome pack somewhere else. So, because having all that stuff loose on the counter was making me uncomfortable. I was like, but I must organize it. Okay, so right now we have water, so I can just fill it up. Yep. Yeah. In my house. Okay. Um, I don't know if the house that you've got has got a fireplace. Pretty sure it does. So even once yeah, the sure. power goes out, you can, if you've got rain buckets, you were able to have okay nice. excess water. We live in a fancy schmancy neighborhood. Yeah, it's pretty nice. <clears throat> All right. So now we've got a bunch of food in here. All right, was that another ad reminder? Oh, fuck's sake, it's another ads again. All right, I'm taking a bio break. I keep on forgetting about ads. Um, You guys should all stand up, stretch, get a drink, have a wee, get the dog, and I'll see you in a couple of minutes. Have a wee. Have a wee. Have a wee. Yeah. Do it. I can't have a cat on me. That'd be uncomfortable for both of us. Ooh, there's a Karen at the school. Uh oh. Run.
Fed the dog, emptied and refilled myself. Much better. I love Echo got me these yoga socks because I keep walking in socks and slipping on our wooden floors. Mm. Oh, sorry, Echo got, yeah, Echo got me these yoga socks and they're not very comfy to walk in, but I don't fall over. Which, you know, I'm a fan of. Okay. Now Ooh, what I am I doing? Stew outside. I see a yellow balloon. Yes, Stu is visiting the school. Nice. Welcome to school. by the sheer amount of cigarettes in these teacher desks. <laughs> Uh, yeah, is there a secret to see those? Or is it full per person? Um, you can, like, I can copy my map onto a, a blank piece of paper. And then you oh, okay. can cop, you can import the markings. Gotcha. Um, if that's something that you, I think that's what we did last time. I'd basically just every day or so I update a map and put it in a bookshelf with a date on it and then people could just come in and import nice, markings. Okay. Yeah, it was mostly because uh, I was trying to see whose house was whose, but so far it hasn't mm -hmm. been too bad because y'all were in your houses, so... I wish you could put um <clears throat> maps on walls oh that's cool be nice if you could i don't think you can but it'd be nice if you could
No, you can't. That's a bugger. Okay, well, if anyone wants my map markings, they're on the coffee table at my place. Mm. So you just need in. Don't worry about me. I'm just here and watering my plants. <laughs> I'm trying to get three of each seed I have so far at least started, so. Um, oh you got a kid's playground in the back yeah do you know how to move that stuff i was trying to move the, move it over some of it but i just may not have clicked the right thing i don't know yeah where do you want it uh well i was <laughs> i guess it's not a big deal anymore because i uh was gonna put the garden there and i just ended up putting it on the side of my house instead so it's fine i just picked it all up <laughs> put it closer to the house like almost against the, the stone essentially i should put it right in front of you in front of your front door <laughs> so you can't okay. get out you're controlling me now hey i'd never do that <laughs> hi hobbits oh that is a pretty little gun you got going on there good job yeah i said to keep them like kind of spaced out or else i would have put them side by side but apparently it helps if they get diseased or something yeah so, all spaced. I don't remember how to do this. Oh, nice, Jer. Ooh, Carpentry 5. I need... So, how do you know a version? So, like, if I have 4 in farming, I need farming 5? Is that what that means? I guess I don't need it, right? I just... If I want to have it extra... Or boosted XP, I want it, right? <clears throat> Yes. So I haven't gained any so far, it seems. Like I said, I'm zero out of 1500, although I've only planted seeds and watered, so maybe that doesn't grant farming XP. I wonder if it's only when you harvest. Yeah, maybe. Oh, maybe. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Thank you, Stu. Why is it working? Hold button and move cursor. Wait. I don't understand. How does that work? Happened. Oh, I don't have the keeping an eye out for uh, mechanics five too. Yeah, your uh, your truck's looking awfully modern for an old timer. What are you talking about? That's a Bronco. I only drive a Ford. That's gotta be like an 80 as well. What are you talking about? 
I mean, it's 1994 in game, or 93 in game, so a 1980s yeah, Bronco is pretty that's new. Fine. 87, that's fine. Where did you move that? Did you put it in front of my door? I'm going over there to find out. How little trust you have in me. <laughs> I don't see it. Is it in my house now? What did you do with it? You'll never know. I must have just missed it. Must have. So, did you have to like take it apart then and put it back together? Yeah, so if you. Oh. There's a menu here. Um, it looks like a little cabinet. And if you mouse over it, it pops out and there's pick up, place, rotate, and disassemble. I see the only one that pops up for me just says disassemble low plastic table. I'm like, no, do not want to do this. So pick up and then you should be able to pass over the thing you want to pick up. Okay, gotcha. No, right, and see, I picked up the playhouse, but I don't know how to place it again. <laughs> it's now yours forever. <laughs> I guess it lives in my inventory. I have the hammer. Don't disassemble number five. Oh, no. right. I'm infected. Are you? That, I mean, you won't die. That's fine. I put some bandage on it, but that's not going to help me. Oh, hang the on. Infection, I think is it? The oh, got some disinfectant. This is bandage now, so. It's, I know I have some. I might have some alcohol wipes on me, but I'm. Oh, no, I you're need. fine. Slight damage. I think I'm okay. I have two yeah, you're fine. alcohol wipes, on, so if I need that, I guess. But yeah, I'm fine now. I took off my bad bandage because I had a bandage from game. Mm. That zombie was chasing me to try to take me out. Such a badass. Damn zombies. <laughs> the one zombie. <laughs> I couldn't even figure out how to hit him in the face with a rake. I could only push him. Hey, pushing is a valid mechanic at this game. <laughs> pushing and head stomping. Oh, true. Yeah, true. When Dell first you... reset the server, I totally forgot how to play and I got totally killed because I couldn't remember how to run or get away from things. When I first well, logged in, I was in a room with a zombie and it just ate me while I was trying to figure out how to move. I was like, I don't remember how to do anything. <laughs> <laughs> um, I can't remember. Hang on. Hang on. Let me. Whoa, God, what have I done? All right. Let me let me find the thing that here. That is a new player guide that Molly did, and it is bookmarked. In uh, Project Zombie chat? Yeah. Oh, no, in okay. uh, in stream chat. Um, oh. But there's... Okay. See what you mean now. Got it. Thank you. When you're talking about the condition or like what remains of the water, it's actually a blue yeah. square that diminishes now. Yeah. Um, so it was like, yeah, we have that green line, it's vanilla, but now I see what you mean. But yeah, she's Molly's working on a series. She's got, I think she's working on episode three right now. But there's two two episodes. But she's really good at explaining things. And taking away the scary mystery of them. So worth in my opinion, totally worth a like and a subscribe. I am biased. But yeah. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Oh, okay. Hey! That's why I have my Yelsey there. 
Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hey, Asbot. <laughs> hey, Asbot. Um, I still don't know explode. how to place this thing. <laughs> I just, I'm sorry, Pyro. I'm still your child's playhouse. I've stolen your your one connection to your to your wayward youth. There, I have pinned it in chat. I probably should put it in Discord too. Actually, that was a good idea. I was hoping there would be gym bottles, and I'm not really seeing any in here. Maybe the school's not big enough. I'd have to go to West Point. Ow. Ick. I'm having some user issues. <laughs> That is pinned in Discord chat as well, the playlist. Um, what am I doing? I, I genuinely have no idea what the fuck I'm doing right now. Smoking. I'm just standing in my house smoking, wondering how the fuck do I get this child's playhouse out of my bag? Which is great because I'm apparently overexerted but desperately needed to smoke. It's like, oh god, I remember those days. I'm puffed. I should have a cigarette. Oh, wait. I think as soon as I started typing in the search, I think I already started remembering how to do it. Wow, those map markings are atrocious. Wait, wait. Oh, never mind, I thought I had it, but I don't. Oh, wait, no, 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 I do, I do, I do, I have it. I got it, I got it. I mean, I'm getting it. Please hold. children chillins then i come make sure my plants are watered all right i'll see y'all later <laughs> see ya. quick don't go pee on his plants while he's not here
I need a like a dinner bell. So when I cook cook a, a feed, I suppose that would be me saying, "Hey, there's food." I found there rotten chicken nuggets. I'm sad. Oh, sadness nuggets. What have we got in this freezer? Hmm, what do you want to cook? Some sausage, muttons, and oysters. Let's do a mutton and oyster something. Mutton and oyster something. Delicious. grapes. That sounds good too. Dun, dun, dun. <clears throat> Frozen grapes sound really good, actually. God, my Twitch dashboard is so out of sync with OBS, it's ridiculous. I think so, I'm in an ad break. <clears throat> See, I think I remember now why I had everything over here from this side. everything the same with I am bringing home the bacon hmm bacon all right create a stew from mutton add some more mutton to it and then some oysters. Oh good, they used all of them. Corn. Meat. <laughs> Meat, oyster and corn stew. Hmm. Okay, now I've added three of something that's going to be considered boring. All right, what, I have oh. some fresh frozen potatoes. Oh, that's all right. I think I've actually got more here than I was expecting. Head beef jerky. No, I'm saving that for a special occasion. Did 
the game has just given up now and it's just like you know what i'm just calling it stew this is just ridiculous stop it A stew with bouillon and olive oil. Mutton, mutton, oyster corn, mutton beans. Mutton, mutton, oyster corn, mutton beans. Mutton, mutton, oyster corn, mutton beans. Perfect. I was like, wait a minute, I don't have any moodles. I was all concerned then that I'd done something. I'm not moodly today. Just a good moodle. Moodly booty. I'm in a... I'm, I'm in a... <laughs> A, a, a new, neutral mood state. I honestly thought it was Friday today. That'd be nice. Oh, well, I actually don't mind because I've now gained a day of playing games. <laughs> I was like, oh, we're a Saturday, right? <laughs> oh god, the week's gone so fast. Well, actually, it hasn't. Oh, I hope nice Stu. that's fantastic news i'm so i'm so pleased that you're taking care of yourself there's uh there's some stew up here if anyone wants some muttons oysters on i only ate a quarter of it so there's enough for everyone else to get a portion i think Yay. Fast and fast off. Coming. Oh, I put that in the wrong place. Oh, you can. Right. I see you've been organizing your kitchen. I have. You set off a house alarm? Uh, no, you just have to wait for it to stop. My my method is yeah run run away and hope that it eventually shuts the fuck up, and be very careful of anything that came to hang out. Is 
it makes sense. No, it doesn't. Oh, wait. Damn it. Did I just spell that wrong? I did. I said apples. Fuck's sake, Dow. There. The house alarms, when I first start playing, are always like, oh god, what have I done? Um, but, but then I get to a point where I'm just like, you know what, sure, bring it. I think we're good on food for a little while. So. Do I have snacks? No, oh, I have some. Oh, wait, I'm in the wrong truck. Oh, I have snacks. Okay. Oh, are you doing something to this truck? I was going to check on your trailer for a second. I mean, I've still got to reverse it out of this driveway, so there's, there's no guarantee that it's going to come out of this alive. I uh, went ahead and just fixed up the trailer body a little bit. Thanks. wasn't terrible. A lot better than I was expecting. Hey, that's fair. Um, I am going, I don't know, somewhere hmm. south. Company? Yeah, south or east? East, I think. We're gonna go east. Oh, yeah. West Point, maybe I see a lot more zombies. I can't go north. There's a river in the way. I don't know if I should have the trailer or not. I guess not. There's no reason why not. All right. We're Thank heading you. off in a, an adventure to the east. Does anyone want to join us? Don't know where we're going, but it's somewhere. Ali, Stu, do you like some chaos? Okay. I figured that might be the case. Oh, 
Well, hopefully, if nothing else, hopefully your appointment with your specialist will help with something mentally, if nothing else. All right, Ali looks like she's still rummaging through houses, so. really need a trailer, but... Yeah. That way if we find anything good. <gasps> no! An empty coffee cup? Blasphemy. the map real quick yeah i know it's a little cheesy but frankly why not doesn't matter it ain't going down easy if it ain't cheesy that's true Oh god. Punky Pink Cow asked me who drank Hobbitses coffee. Probably Gollum. Sneaky little Hobbitses with their tricksy ways. Always trying to ruin his precious morning routine. But oh. I wouldn't put it past him to blame innocent bystanders like me. All while standing there with coffee breath. <laughs> Very good. Thank you, Punky. That was very well done. I love how, like, it's getting a lot of contextual clues from things, and I think that's brilliant. <laughs> I'm glad you think so. I really enjoy Tangier so much more than any of those other things that I've tried. Oh, right. Like a hitchhiker on the inside of my shirt who was itching my tummy. And they don't scare me, which, you know, I mean, some of them still make me jump a little bit, but it's a lot less alarming. Is there a way to create thread or disassemble something into thread? Um, if you're in a certain level, you can rip clothes to get thread. So, I mean, ripping, like, pants and de denim does give you experience for tailoring. But I think after, like, a level or two, when you start ripping, you get thread. Okay. Thank you for the which biddies, is, boy. Which is why I've been hoarding a bunch of piles of clothes everywhere. Thank you. Yeah, easy. Just get a spinning wheel. Yeah, I knew I was getting it from something, but I wasn't sure if it was from looting or breaking down other stuff. All right, I'm right behind you. The the goo on your radiator almost makes it look like you've got a red nose on your truck, like a festive Rudolph, Rudolph. The red nose truck. Except it's zombie gets. Oh, there's a zombie. Hi, zombie. Yeah, I killed a few down here last night, but I guess they all respawned. Just realized this not, might not be the road I think it is. 
Um, it, I don't know. When the good road goes, I'll probably turn right to get on the main road so we can get into West Point. I got in the wrong bloody seat again. These American cars with their left hand wheels. And stuff. Oh dear. Whoops. Stopping? Sorry, I was checking the map. my character hungry again come on no 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 i have a bunch of snakes in my truck if you need something oh like a lot but i've got like what do i have no oh, i will have some candy never mind <laughs> yeah uh, i was gonna say i had some i just had some chips so there we go oh now i see there we go now i'm hungry my hair just like all oh, right yeah i'm hungry too i made some okay, here's the turn i'm thinking Basically, when the good road ends, turn right. What? Here? Yeah. I uh, thought this was a different road. <laughs> so I'm trying to get back on the road I th was thinking it's supposed to be. Oh, alright. So I was thinking since we want Zombles, we might want to go to West Point. I don't particularly want Zombles, I'm just... Getting some map exposure. That too. Apparently, eating gum didn't help with my hungry. Weird that. Rock is so loud. I have to look for muff. It's probably just because I could turn the game sound down for myself and it'd be fine. I have it like cranked way up so I can hear like zombie gross wet sounds. Hey, cop car. be so bad but I have to like keep stopping and starting so it's like loud quiet loud quiet loud quiet and I uh... oh speaking of which did my music stop nope it didn't I just kind of hear it over the truck voice Anki? I can hmm, what's going on why can't I barely hear Punky I don't really hear her either you don't hear me no oh, I do now. Oh, now now we do oh I think it was coming in through my webcam which you know is always the best way for you to get your audio going. Mm. Yeah, webcams are great for mouth noises. Oh, don't say it that way. That's gross. <laughs> mouth noises. This makes me think of all the worst mouth noises you could possibly make. And then, like, how you can feel your own tongue. Oh, stop. I don't want to feel my own tongue. I don't want to... Great. 
And now I can see my nose too, damn it! <laughs> Del! <sighs> <laughs> I love you. Wow. Yeah. Uh huh. Okay. Good. <laughs> I uh, I recently acquired my own VTube character that's all rigged up and everything. I don't know when I'm gonna start streaming, but I want to do that soon. Excellent. You should. How's the zomboid going? Um. I'm just following Toast down a random road, so I don't know. I'm assuming I was supposed to go straight at that junction. Almost nobody yes. in this community is straight, dear. <laughs> so good luck. We're all either gay or adjacent. Yeah. I like that, adjacent. Downside of Riverside is that we're pretty far away from a lot of stuff, so to get out of town takes a bit. I cleared a lot of the cars out of the way before, so I probably could pick up the pace a little bit. Should be better once we get out of town, though. I will. It'll help once the light comes up a bit, but yeah. That it's too. As I said, the, the audio of the car truck getting louder and quieter and louder and quieter is one of those things that's making me like... Grrr. No, oh, it's not you. It's the fucking truck for being so loud. Is uh, oh, ve Ooh, hey, never mind. Vehicle engine volume slider. Full tip. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Is that what the tool tip said? Yep. Oh god, thank you. Okay, problem solved. You're very um, sensation sensitive sensory sensitive mm -hmm. sound like is a big one for me sound and smell I am I'm just coming used to, to realize, being very uncomfortable I'm coming That's to bothering. realize that it's a lot more than I, I thought it was like a lot of my <clears throat> anxiety about things is, that I have is not necessarily anxiety it's just Overstimulus from noise and tactile stuff. Makes a lot of sense. Like, a fire engine going past will genuinely make me want to cry if its sirens are going. And part of it is just like this weird empathy of oh god that means someone's upset and hurt, hurt maybe but also it's just I hate the loud volume and I used to get yelled at by my mom for crying when the fire engines moved past and she'd tell me to stop being so silly and stop being so ridiculous it's just a fire engine but that's supportive parenting I mean you know just punch her in the nose and then tell her to stop being so sensitive yeah I could. That would mean having to like physically interact with her at some point though, and I'd rather not do that. I swear a lot of my sensory issues are from that, like being forced to eat certain foods, like forcibly fed certain foods is why I don't like things like pumpkin and sweet potatoes. Yeah, like, especially, that's the thing. Yeah, like, it just makes so much sense. But especially for, like, little kids, it's so okay, common. Paco just came into my office and he said, Tell Del, I said, Ooh. Ooh. Hello, Paco. <laughs> yeah, like, when kids, most of the time, when little ones, especially, like, toddlers are having full on meltdowns at the store. They're not being assholes. They're genuinely overstimulated and their brains are trying to make sense of all the input. And so yelling at them to like calm down and trying to reason with them doesn't work. You just have to like tell them it's okay to feel what you're feeling and you can remove them from the situation. But like getting in their face and yelling ain't gonna do anything but make them more upset. 
Like their brains are literally forming, forming new, more neural connections. Their brains are still cooking, and sometimes things go wonky, you know. And that's kind of how I I sort of see it with the like oversensitive of stuff. I should say hypersensitive. That makes it more positive sounding. It's just neurons, yeah, and their their brains are still forming. Like even teenagers with their impulse control. The prefrontal cortex is like, what the fuck do I do with all this hormone shit? Though admittedly teenagers are just assholes as well, but... <laughs> but that's part of it. I would argue that that's people. People are assholes. I yeah. dislike people. But like, the the impulse control thing is... Is brains still figuring out how to brain? I feel like most adults don't seem to evolve beyond their teenage years anyway. I was or at a least dick. their basic social <laughs> strategies kind of develop within the teen years. I was a horrible, horrible teenager. Bruh, same. I, I was so honestly prepared. when I moved out of home and got away from parental units, all of a sudden I became less of an asshole. Heard that. I'm just babe. <laughs> I had to move out of Texas. That was when I was 20. I moved out of yeah. Texas for a year, and when I came back, I was different. I just, just had yeah. to be alone. I, I left home at 15 and was declared independent, which is like the Kiwi version of being emancipated. And I went through this like interview process with the government, and I didn't realize really what it was. Um. But this interview process, they were like, they have to try and, and form, like, they have to try and mediate. And I re do remember talking to this woman and she spoke to my mom and then she got off the phone and she's like, honey, you're fine. <laughs> and I was like, oh, yes. So, I but, yeah. didn't really have the guts to do anything like that. I just kind well, of I accepted didn't... my mom's brainwashing. I didn't, it wasn't guts, like when I was 15, it was like, toast. <laughs> toast was playing tiger practice. I was, I literally just moved away from home and to be able to get on any form of financial support, that was part of the process. And I didn't realize until afterwards, it actually meant that I was legally independent. It was just a, a pleasant side effect, but I've been doing that people pleasing thing up until I don't know, like last week? Pretty, well not last week, but I've only recently in the last like couple of years learned to put my foot down and get some agency back for myself. And it is a, it's a very dangerous trait to have. Uh, the left or right? for me, um, left. The awkward thing for me is going back in hindsight or actually bringing up something about my childhood and then people are like, um, hun, that's not normal. Yeah. I think- Oh, I love that feeling. Very few people have what's considered a normal childhood. But yeah, there's definitely I would say there's a very strong arguments for cause and effect with uh, these childhood shenanigans and bullshit that we had to put up with in the uh, formation of who we are now. I mean, I wouldn't change it. I am who I am because of the experiences that I've had. But still, you know, it'd be nice to have a little bit of belief and faith when you're younger. Yes, all you can do is I'm not convinced that it would because I've seen at this point like uh cuz I have younger sisters who mm. were my dad's second family and they got everything. They they weren't impoverished, they didn't have well, like I don't mean sort of... getting everything. I mean like having a parental unit who says I believe in you and yeah, that too. Or uh, use faith. you as your emotional or physical punching Yeah, bag. like, I, I'm not talking material stuff. I, I can't speak to that because, you know, I'm, I'm very familiar with food poverty, but... And I'm not I'm not trying to get a pity party, but... So I, I can't I can't speak to the material thing, but... 
I really feel like being like there's definitely some some key experiences that I had as a young person where if I had been listened to my life right now would be very very different and I would have a lot less trauma now I think I don't, I don't want to get into tricky diagnosed. subjects for people yeah. <laughs> yeah it's okay I'm just quietly sitting here being like yeah Yeah. It's a balance, because if you if you go too far the other way, it also creates problems. Well, yeah, but I'm not saying, like, blind agreement that children, all children are right, because, like I said, kids are assholes. Yeah. But if your kid comes to you and says, hey, I'm being bullied, or hey, I've been abused, then listen to them. You should probably give them uh, an ear. Yeah, that, that yeah. would... You know... A little bit of that's that's what I mean by belief and faith, and teaching them about healthy gender roles and not indoctrinating them in in you know, women must do the dishes and men do the work and blah blah blah. Like teaching them what's tasty. healthy. I love ro ye yeast rolls with fresh butter. Mm. Oh yeah. No trauma, only yeah. bread. I don't, I don't really know that it's, um, like there's definitely an improvement, but especially when you consider how little me medical science factors in uh, any form of like femme health. Like most medical trials don't factor in. We were actually Anything talking to about do with estrogen. In my uh, my Discord, we were talking about the fact that, like, they didn't actually care to include women as like a different factor in a lot of clinical trials until the '90s, and they they so they know very little about what a fucking yeah. uh, what a, a heart attack looks like in a woman. Exactly. And yeah. They know even less about how like trans hormone therapy can affect folks too. So like. So, if a woman goes into an ER complaining about heartburn, for instance, most of the time uh, she will get dismissed as heartburn, unless there's often unless there's a uh, a, a femme person on hand who's like, wait, that, uh, that's a heart she, attack you're having. That actually reminds me of a real life situation I had when I worked in the crisis unit. Um, exactly, we were, Molly, yeah. We you're we evaluating someone who did have a history of depression. She also had multiple medical issues. She was a cancer survivor. Everything under the sun. She survived strokes. But she was thinking that she was having a severe panic attack, and she was willing to sign herself in to be admitted to a psychiatric hospital. And the center I worked at did do those direct admits. So yeah. we were evaluating her, but I'm watching her observing this, and I'm thinking that, like, some of the symptoms she had, like, it got worse. She was showing some physical things, and I'm sitting there thinking, sometimes a panic attack and a heart attack look really similar. Uh -huh. And before they're going to, a psych hospital is going to want her, they're going to make sure there's nothing medical going on. So we actually called an ambulance. We got her there, and it turned out, yeah, she was having a heart attack. Yeah, it I'm like, dude. It wasn't a panic attack. It was a heart like... attack. So we kind of saved her life plus, in a different way. Yeah, heartburn plus cyanosis, probably a heart attack. But, she was, a, yeah. yeah, she was a very <laughs> nice lady. It, it was just like kind of explaining to the emergency people over the phone and to like the team, the nursing team that we worked with of like, hey, she is someone who does have a psych history. She was willing to sign herself in, but a lot of her symptoms are looking like a mix and we want to rule this out. I mean, so, that's good nope. care. That is true. Turned we out, aren't doing lobotomies yeah. anymore. Very important. Out, yeah, she was actually having a heart attack. So they were able to catch it early before it did anything really serious. They, they, they think drives me nuts, Molly. Like, the number of, of women who are like, can I please get a hysterectomy? No, you might want children. Like, uh, I'm one of those femme bodies, mm -hmm. actually. Or, yeah. or what's even crazier to me is like, what if one day your husband wants you to have kids? And it's oh, like... Oh, I know when you're not married and you're like excuse me i think i know what i want 
Hey. What does your husband think? Ooh. <laughs> I feel like Toast just ran over that zombie as like a. <laughs> it's like, uh, okay, first doctor I saw confirmed I'm functionally sterile. My ex left me over it, and you're telling me. And the only reason why I want it removed is because it's a cancer risk. Can we please? <laughs> yeah. Can we please remove it? There is no chance of me reproducing here. It's it's crazy, Ugh. like some of that. It's like you've seen what my ovaries look like on on scans. There's nothing viable left. Ooh, it was time for some jelly beans. It's fucking wild. I mean, anybody should have the the ability to to do with their reproductive health what they want. And the fact that like you are when you're so unviable and you have like so many issues that they're still giving you pushback on that that's just that makes yeah molly berry said it right that's that is that's a good reaction yeah. to that the other one of the other ones that made me laugh was um when covid vaccine came out and i remember talking about we talked about it on stream how almost everyone i know who had um there's everyone who had possession of a uterus and menstruated who were vaccinated every single person had an irregular period like everyone that i spoke to was like yes my period went weird. fucking yep. whack Mine was and weird too. the medical profession were like no that's not a thing it doesn't affect it and i was like mine started two weeks early the afternoon i got my first vaccination and they finally were like, oh, yeah, no, that's a thing. And we're like, uh, hello. We've I been telling you that. Much. Yeah. I was like, mm, I don't, think I don't know my, anyone who, who didn't have. Now, yeah. Hey, found a cooler for you. Woohoo. I don't know anyone who didn't have a janky period. It's bonkers. Um, but it, it's taken years for them to admit that, yes, that's a thing. That's a thing that could happen. Man, I got rain healed with it, huh? <laughs> there were some oh, more zombies coming out of the trees, but I figured since I knew we were talking about coolers. Oh yeah, no when good I saw cool. a tent, I'm like, hey, there's might be a cooler. Is there, Do you there's want no another food here, pot? here. Eh. There's beer. Oh, rotten uncooked stew. Hmm, sure. You know what? I'll drink the beer. No one's gonna ticket you for drinking and driving here. Mm. It's fine. I, I've got my Pepto. I, I'm gonna judge you. It's been fabulous. Only Chubbs can judge me. Chubbs McGee. <laughs> Zombie, please. Please. <laughs> God, that was terrible. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I don't know what I was doing. Come out. Come out, little... Oh, hi, zombies. Uh... Oh, there's only two of them. Only one each. Oh, do you want me to leave this one for you? No, you can have it. Okay, zombie with a suit and a tie. But a duffel bag. <laughs> have not... had a drink all night, Constable. Oh, there be a Oh god, it's an ATS stream. <laughs> Basically, yeah, this can turn into American Truck Sim pretty easily. Or American Truck Sim could turn into Project Zomboid. That would be more entertaining. Oh, they need to make like a zombie ad zombie apocalypse from Apocalypse, Apocalypse edition. Apocalypse. Yes. <laughs> Look, wedding is hard, man. Sometimes I think of three words at once and they all want to come out of my mouth at the same time. Yeah. Got two and a half packs of smokes? Damn, Del. I know, what right? I'm basically. Watch out for um, the Yeah, I was like, if I was in prison, I'd be the boss right now. More burnout like vehicles. High roller. I have literally hundreds more cigarettes back at my house. Okay, we have a cup. Oh, hi, Zomples. 
Yeah, COVID. It's like Ooh, these things zombies. change. Oh my oh, god! Yeah. Don't even get me started. Zombies. I could tell you a thing or two about long COVID. My boss currently has COVID. Gross. She's working remotely. Oh. Still insisting on working. There's a few working. more coming out of the. We all keep wanting her to take off. Hey, that's butt. Hey. Ugh, I miss my katana. Anyone else? Anyone else want a piece of this? Got any good shit? Okay, so we can take this road and enter the center of town if you would like. Or we can go to the edge and then go in. I am not phased. I have no preference. I know okay. I have to yell IRL too in case they can't hear me. And also it entertains me far too much to say hey ass, but because in my head have more fun going in the center of the town. I I totally hear it voiced by uh, Misha Collins. I really need to get a sound bite of that. Ooh, trailers. Mm. Yeah, I was gonna say there's a market. We could check it out. It's not the center okay. of town, but it's something. <laughs> I mean, I'd rather they didn't. Are you like looking for a new base or something? Nope, we're just looking for stuff to smash. Oh. Let me smash. Let me smash. Hey, you guys! Oh, hi, Zambos. This may have been a bad idea. Oh, that's the wrong button. <laughs> this is fine! Hey! Oh, that one's got a pretty red apron. Go for it. I don't need you it. I need to wash it. Oh, you don't want it? Nope. Pizza world. There's probably tons of sadly rotten cheese in there, and that mm. makes me sad to think about. Ooh, more zombies. Ooh, three more zombies. They came to your thing. The beeping. Perfect. Oh, this one had a boo boo. Now oh, it's got another one and another one. Is foul. That is what that is. Tomato paste. Ooh, There's a sink to yeast. fill your water bottles if needed. Yeah, may as well. Oh, cheese is still fresh. Must put in freezer. Pepperoni is still fresh. Cheese. I'm gonna eat the pepperoni. Good idea. Well, one of the pepperonis. There's another pepperoni if you want to eat it. There's, there's a cockroach. Nah. There's pepperoni and then there's cheese. Rotten undercooked dough. A little tragic there. Ooh, olive oil. Attention to Theta. Lots of tomato paste here. Ooh, trash cans! Garbage blood cockroaches again. Ooh, dead rats! Smash bottles. Luxury. Ooh, zombie. Come here, zombie. Ooh, another zombie. Hi, zombie. Ooh, 
more, more zombies. Hi, zombies. Come play catch the machete. Yeah. Aw, uh, better luck next time. Not enough zombies. Okay, we'll have to go deeper. Oh. Orange soda. Mm. Oh, man, I could so go for a Fanta right now. Ooh, another generator magazine. What the mm, heck is a quagga yeah. cake? I'm gonna eat it. I don't know what it is, but I'm gonna eat it. I think it's a parody of zebra cakes. Oh. Donkeys. Ooh. Apparently I've not been gorging on enough junk food. Do better, Dal. Ooh, arcade machines. I don't want to grab them right now, but it's good to know they're there. Ooh, yeah, let's see what's in here. Put a note on your map. Ooh, all these goodies. Chop. Yeah, I'm like, ooh, snack cakes. Hell yeah. yeah. Consider, like, leave this for other adventures. Right now. Sorry, Punky. I said, dude, I could really go for a Twinkie or a Ho-Ho right now. Gummy beers. They call these plonkies and high highs. Did you get yourself some candies? I could get more candies. Gummy worms. Quagga is an extinct type of zebra. Hmm. Sucks with the zebra. Well, the quagga, I guess. Good job, zebra. How to use generators. We already have that one. Grab most of the VHS tapes for the heck of it. Man, now I just want a bunch of little DBs. Yeah, that sounds about right. Ooh, it's a strip. Oh, hey, zombie at the door. Stole yeah. the crap out of my character. One on the window, too. Hi, buddy. I don't know why you can't just walk through when it's a full window. Yeah, it does seem a little weird. Hey, another interesting little convenience store. Like what are you doing in this game? Ah, uh, you get eaten by zombies. Aww. I mean, when you're being Burritos. successful. It's it's kind of a like the idea is to survive as long as you can with the knowledge that at any time you may have to restart. Like life. Um, so it's like survival, uh, you know, survival sandbox, but no, I still don't really know how to describe it. I kind of don't really need any more junk food. I think we're just going to leave it here. 
Yeah, snacks for later. Maybe mark it on your map. Here there be snacks. Please. Uh, I keep a lot of landmarks memorized, so I'm not too worried about that. Snacks. I don't know why I was doing that, honestly. Ooh, a clothing store. Very sparse clothing store. It's like a Ross that's going out of business. Yeah. Yeah, it is. Through here. Oh, come on. There might have been an internal wall there. I've been feeling there. a sort of crafter's block. I don't know what to make. It'd make me kind of sad. Because I'm like, I'm not really making anything right now. Like, I did just finish my journal, and I have the shelves behind me that I'm going to be working on putting together, but that doesn't really feel like... It's not a, mm. like, fiber craft, I guess? I don't know. I understand that. Is it because... You... I think it's because a lot of my crafting stuff is still in boxes because I don't have shelves mm -hmm. yet. So I need to do one to be able to do the other, but... Yeah. Yeah. I like my little reactive. Oh, you hot wiring oh. all the cars. Aww. Just checking them. I guess I should, though, just for experience points, right? Good lord. Mm hmm? You can hear my, my husband and my roommate just kind of drunkenly talking about before the Crusades, when knights were first being made into a thing, and just being history nerds, just nerds. And they're just kind of drunkenly slurring history facts at each other. That's adorable. So like the, like the drunk history show, but in your living room? In my living room, yes. Why is it I can never remember how to back up correctly on this? There we go. I mean, to be fair, it's kind of tricky going forwards in this. The wits would probably say something, something, AFAB, something, something, but I'm not a wit, <laughs> so. Yes, Molly. Oh, Luke, <laughs> that's a very good egg fact. Well, people kept on asking questions, and I'm like, you should go and check out Molly's playlist on starter guides for Project Sunboy. Luke has got like the best egg facts. They're just like really good. That is true hobbits. I just got into my truck and started driving and okay. I was like, I don't know if I should or not. <laughs> oh. That's okay, I already hit one zombie with the truck up here. Good job. Now it's deciding how far to go and where to go. I don't know. Hey, zombie. It is the Kiwi Hanging way. The... Ooh, zombies on the street corner. Ooh, hi, zombies. Let's go. Ooh, that's a... Ooh. Catch the machete. Oh, better luck next time. Hey. Hey. 
sounds so squishy. Ooh, there's a zombie over here following you. Just wants to be included. I was about to tell that zombie about Blue Fang. Oops. I'll have to do it in chat now instead. Well, I'm stealing their jacket. There we go. That's fair. Ooh, yeah, look at this. This big map. Lots of places to explore. There's schools, auto body shops. Houses. What is... Oh god. Honky Pink Cow asked me, what is your best scrambled egg recipe? Scrambled eggs, you say? In a non-stick pan, mix your eggs mm -hmm. with a mm -hmm. pinch of salt and pepper. Get that pan hot, but not too hot. Not too hot. You don't want a bloody rubbery mess. Then Ugh. gently stir with a spatula, like you're folding it over, not like you're chasing zombies. Take what? the pan off the heat while they're still slightly runny. They'll continue to cook. Zambles. Finish with a touch of butter for richness. It's not rocket science. It's scrambled bloody eggs. It's obviously taking in my game category in, like into consideration here. That's definitely got to be the case, right? Because like... They wouldn't know otherwise. I mean, Attenborough earlier said, like, that you were... Ooh, construction zombie. ...figuring out the migratory patterns of the common zombie, so... Well, didn't you ask him... ask David Attenborough about migration patterns of zombies, though? Yeah, yeah, but then at the very end, he was saying, like, and Dell is currently... Uh, mapping out the migratory patterns of the common mm. zombie in Project Zomboid, so... It definitely like knows what you're playing. It's, I feel like that's a newer thing. Like I said, like, Luke's got all the egg facts. Yeah. You know what we can do here? Let me just get in oh, this... Oh, come here, Zombo. Oh, really? You're not gonna let me in? I wish my yell did more big yell sounds. Fuck. Why do I try and word? Ooh, sample. Burned out house. Molly Berry asked me, are you more afraid of snakes or zombies? Zombies? Please, they're as slow as a week in jail. And <laughs> snakes, they ain't nothing but a legless walk in Did the Did you park. know that duck eggs are better for baking because they have a higher fat content? Ain't no fear in this heart, baby. <laughs> Molly, that was a really good one. Duck eggs are amazing for baking. I, I, yeah, I, I don't think he's he's concerned with either at this point. Are you waiting for me? I was running around smacking some zombies nearby. Okay. I wasn't sure what the plan was. Violence. Zombies on a motherfucking plane. Molly, thanks for doing Tangia. I'll move the car up. Well, this truck up. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> it's pretty weird.
I just realized that truck doesn't seem to have a horn. Your truck doesn't have a horn? Aw, oh, that's sad. Good night, Stu. I hope you get a good sleep. Good luck with your appointment tomorrow. Hello, anyone? See, no, oh, I'm still worried that... Uh, what is the, on the, it? The... your head, dude? Oh, never mind. It's just your hair. Oh, wow. Ouch. Wow. Wow. Toes. They're probably really proud of that hairstyle. Hey. That was hey. brutal. Hey, wow. they could be proud of it. I just didn't know what it was. This. Uh, hello? There we go. I'm not even bothering to raid the house at the moment. I don't even know what's in them. Ooh, generator. <laughs> yeah, I can hear... Squeaky hands on glass. Ooh, zombie in the street. It's just not enough. Like, have you been through here before? Is that why it's quiet? Actually, I haven't. It's just that I haven't really broken into anything in here. So they're probably hoarding somewhere uh, then. Oh, there's a couple in the house here. Eh. I was trying to get us more like to the city center to see how it was like. Cause I am, I mean, I mean, think about the previous server. Does it seem like there's less zombies in the previous one? I don't know. I never got to this. This, oh God, that would be terrible. It's like, <laughs> Drex with the, the power outage sound from Satisfactory. Even when I'm not playing Satisfactory and haven't for months, that still makes me panic. I'm pretty sure the squeaky, the squeaky glass hand sound would... Mm-mm. And I almost always just assume it's Soma doing it. Kind of feels like this server has less zombies than the previous version. Well, I didn't change any server settings. The last, the last server we were on, we didn't get out of Muldrow. Or yeah. Muldrow, what do we call it? Maybe it could be just like different cities. Having a factor there. This game looks like fun. It is. Um, yeah. Or may maybe I'm just agitating more for violence than last Maldraw. Okay. Or maybe um, we're just we've gotten a lot better. No, there's just like no one here to beat up. But yeah, the server settings were started quite low. But also, I'm also wondering because there's like a, a multiplier. So as time goes on, you get more and more zombies. But be before. That could be a factor. Ali, um, so the peak day is like day 50. So it may just be that the, the density, like they haven't all just spawned in yet. We haven't seen the peak yet. That could be it. Ali, that is really me, and I have no doubt that you will in fact do that. Oh, there's a few over here. Hey! Today is Thursday the 4th. It is. It's less than a week to my birthday now. Ooh, this is zombie. I'm going to need to put together your order. Go ahead. Dumplings. I finally picked something. Dumplings and you said chocolate pie, chocolate right? Chocolate pie. Yeah. Ooh. You usually order from Publix, right? Uh, yes. Stuff in here. Off? Yeah, this is a uh, car parts. This is an auto body shop. Not 
not the big one, but it's an auto body shop. Alright, cheers, violets. Hi, Zombo. Eesh. Oh, dear. I think I know that sound, Ali. I mean, I probably would if I heard it. Oh. I'm grabbing this tire. It's it heavy. sounds tiresome. Yeah. Oh, of course a zombie shows up while I do this. Music is so weird. Wait, what are you doing? I thought you were still inside. Oh, I went back to the truck with the tire because tires are heavy. Oh, okay. And killed two zombies that were at my truck. Might move my truck over there so I can load it up. That was a terrible idea. Oh, I found a bar. Oh, nice. Boost, 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 boost. When in doubt, boost. Kind of dark. These rooms, why do they not have oh, light switches? Never mind, I got it. I almost half expect to see a more light switches mod. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there's been a lot of rooms we've gone into where there's been no. no light switches. I forgot the word we were of the thing we were talking about. Even though I literally just said it. I'm just on this like one woman journey to eat all the potato chips and smoke all the cigarettes in this world. You know, we all have to have a reasonable goal, and I feel like yeah. that's yours. It is. And also to collect all the keys. So there's two chocolate pies and about a million chocolate cakes. There's a Marie mm. Callender's chocolate satin pie mm. and a Edward's Hershey's chocolate cream pie. Hmm. Personally, I think the Edwards Hershey's chocolate cream pie looks better, but do you have a sure. preference? Uh, no, no, they're, but they're both going to go in my face hole. Okay, cool. Um, and, and be devoured. I thought they said the bar was I called the drunk. I think I've eaten both of those. Yeah, I probably have too. I'm being very sneaky with my 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 preference here because Punky sends me like a little uh not a little but a, a delicious treat for my birthday each year. And the f the first year Punky did it. Someone ate my birthday cake. Almost all of my birthday cake and it wasn't me. That's um, not great. <laughs> and I was like, you know what? Oh no, there's rotten croissants! Uh, uh, and so now what I do is I request chocolate pie because a certain someone... Ooh, cookie. A certain someone does not like chocolate pie. It's a good strat. Um, do you want chicken so, pot stickers or pork pot stickers? Uh, I don't have a preference. 
So, yeah, so now I request chocolate pie so I can be a, a, a gremlin, a pie goblin, as you were. Whoopsie. And, um, be a nice little monster and devour it all. Ooh, frozen it, steak, shrimp, peas, eggs. Is it time? Is it time zombie? for? Hear a zombie cry nearby. Wait, have we got a? I didn't bring a cooking pot. Baking tray, a kettle, and a spatula. I mean, the pot stick is like. Oh god, I love I love dumplings, and I can like devour a bag in like two seconds flat. I hear a zombie crying from somewhere, but I don't know where. Oh, I can't. Maybe it's the building next door. Oh, wait a minute. You can get on the second floor of these. There's apartments upstairs. Oh, maybe that's at the end. Oh, wait, hang on. Oh, oh God, maybe the bathroom. I'm assuming that's refilling your water and not going for a wee. I heard that. Hey, hey. Hello? I noticed another oh, door go. here. I think that might be the door to the upstairs. Cigar City Brewing Company's Florida Man Double IPA. Ooh. Seriously? Florida Man IPA? That sounds like Whoa. something that would, I don't know, spontaneously combust or... Or you use it to like clean out your lawnmower's oil tank or something, yeah. Hear something go bang, bang, bang. Oh, in here? It's probably the Florida Man beer! Delicious! Oh, that just reminded me, I have beer in the fridge. Do you want me to get any alcohol? No, thank you. Okay. Yep, these are... Ooh, some smacking up there. turn the light on and instead hey these are cute little apartments oh cooking pot perfect Ooh, this fridge is full of stuff that's sadly mostly rotten but i am grabbing the butter yeah ipas i can sort of take or leave they do taste mm, I don't know, it depends on it obviously but i often find that they taste like smelly socks to me Indian food? Yes. I miss Indian food. I used to live within walking distance of Brick Lane in London, which is like the uh, the place to get Indian food. I'm just eating some ice cream. I'll put it back in the freezer. Want to get some? Toast? Oh, did you get the uh, cooking pot? Yeah. Okay, cool. I don't like there's spicy this, though, but there's but yeah, this brand that I've been really enjoying their microwave meals, and I was thinking about getting you a couple of them so you could try Ooh. them. 
Yeah. Um, they have a really good tikka masala and a really good butter chicken. Butter chicken, all the way, butter chicken. Hell Actually, yeah. we were surprised. I can't remember. I think it might have been Target. Target has their own brand of some sauces, and they have a really good instant pot lemon and garlic instant pot sauce. And they also have a really good butter chicken sauce. What's in here, I think. That was quick. Mm, butter. Fresh, creamery butter. I love these little flats. They're so spacious. Makes me miss my, my little bed set that I had in London. Ah, keep on standing in the wrong spot to do the door pop. There's uh, an entire tub of melted ice cream fresh that's about to go off in here in this freezer. I've just had one and there's another. Okay, I'll eat it. it. Took so much convincing. Ooh, they have chicken, pork, steak, bacon. I just realized I keep on going to look in the top window for the loot. So. Alright. Well, oh. I was like, well, I wanted the pot to do a feast. And there's more meat, so you can make a very meaty feast. We got some cans here. Oh, hey, we got, mm, got canned tomato. All right, let's take that. Take all the meats. All the meats. And the canned tomato. Maybe Arby's. We got the meats. Oh no, my stomach's rumbling now because I'm just like, mmm, dumbly. Uh, what do you got here? Meh. I don't know that it'll let me put pineapple in a... Wait, isn't that where we just were? No, it's not. Maybe? Interesting that there's no dry goods here. There's mixed vegetables, corn... Oh, dry goods? You mean like canned stuff? No, or you mean like, like pasta dried and rice goods. And stuff? Pasta and rice, yeah. Yeah, I've noticed that a lot of these have like canned corned beef in them. They like their spam. Ooh, sausage. All right, let's see what we can make out of this. Probably too much. Bacon, chicken, mixed veggies, corn, pork chops, sausage, and steak. This is going to be the sort of stew that you will be left, like, so constipated from all the protein. But it'll be delicious and totally worth it. And that's why we had ice cream before. Balances out. The music stop? No, my earbuds just got loose again. Hell, cooking pot. Create stew from steak. Meat. 
is going to be a very not boring do. Okay, I've, I've put as much main ingredient in as I can. Do you need any butter, olive oil, or vegetable oil? Yes. There you go. Here's some tomato paste, too. <laughs> the main ingredient is love. Ooh, tomato paste. Delicious. Add butter as spice. Mm. All right, that is as loaded with stuff as it's going to get. I mean, there's veggies in there. It's food for the heart. Attack. Yeah, I was like, weren't we just talking about heart attacks before? I've had a, uh, a real hankering for Guinness lately. The, um, I've had like, so I've got Yingling, which obviously is not a star, but, and that was really good, but I was just like, think about Guinness, it's mist just mysteriously delicious. You want Guinness? I don't need, no, I, I've got a, you're, you're already sending pie and dumplings. That's okay. I don't need more. You growl at me. I'm also mindful that you just moved house and had a big house. bunch of repairs and can't afford to do frivolous, big, expensive things. So just a four count then. That's what I'm hearing. Okay, so let me go yeah. over what I've got here. I've got Hershey's chocolate cream pie. A nine ounce uh, thing of chicken pot stickers, a 18 ounce vegetable fried rice, a nine ounce of uh, frozen egg rolls, two butter chickens, a on sale deep dish apple pie ice cream, and four Guinness draft beers in a can. And a partridge in a pear tree. Does that sound good? It sounds fucking amazing okay and like something that i'm not gonna have to cook for myself which is even better yeah but at least if i do it's not a lot of messing about it's not great but it's sometimes it's what i, I hang i'd much rather have uh, like a young's chocolate stout that's uh that's all yours on the counter there toes Yay. Like Young's chocolate stout is probably one of my favorite ones, but I just sometimes I just get angry for Guinness. I drank a lot of it when I was living in the UK. A lot. They had a um, Christmas beer on discount at the store on their way home. I think, um, I, man, I almost ended that up working bad. at a Young's pub. Setting mm -hmm. up delivery right now, uh, 9 a.m. to noon on Tuesday the 9th. Is there anything later? Yeah, I can do later. I don't, uh, I don't understand 9 a.m. Oh, do you want like the afternoon? Hmm. One to four? Perfect. Okay. Yeah, I don't I... understand 9am. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, 9am is not in my lexicon. I now have a bunch of like, I'm going to have to cook another stew because I just have all this meat in my inventory now. Um, I almost ended up working at a Young's pub beard back when I lived in New Zealand. Um, I... I managed an English pub 
and I had a sales rep that I got on really well with who just acted as like the sales rep for Young's in our region. And when he found out that I was moving to the UK, he put in a word for me um, with the CEO of Young's. It's basically like, you know, this, this Kiwi uh, lady's coming to the UK and she's looking for work in hospital, blah, 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 blah. Unfortunately, as it turned out, our paths crossed because the CEO of Young's decided to go and raise alpaca. And so the email got lost in the transition of leadership. <laughs> um, but I did find a, a Young's bar that I almost got a job in, but the it was at a bartender and the manager's like, you've been a manager for too long. I don't think you're going to be comfortable being in a a bartending position because I was just like yeah we can help you out with like your cost of sales and blah 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 and she was like I think this is going to be right for you <laughs> which was fair probably wouldn't be um but yeah I young are just good quality but I think with the Guinness I think part of it is the water quality I don't know if that's just like in my head, but it seems like water makes such a big difference in cooking and baking that it makes sense that it would make a difference for brewing as well. Makes sense to me. Re create stew. Yeah, we're doing more stew because that's. <laughs> While we're talking about water and beer and all that, I think I'm going to grab a beer out of the fridge. Hey! I'm so envious. Oh, punky. Oh, do you? <gasps> give, us, give us the tea or the, the pint, I guess, would be the more, more appropriate. It did seem to me like the Guinness I got in London tasted a lot better than the Guinness I drank in New Zealand. And I didn't know if that was because it was like brewed under license or imp versus like actually imported. Mm. And All right, order's been confirmed, delivery mm. is set, so it should be on its way. <laughs> Thank you. I love traditions, especially it makes, this one. Yeah. It makes such a big difference. And honestly, beer taps are so fucking gnarly. They, like, if you don't clean them often, they get gross really fast. Like, all that yeast and sugar, very, very quickly you get like a buildup of like fucking gnarly slime. It's gross. Sugar slime? Yeah, it's like this weird goo. <laughs> I don't I don't know quite. Yeah, it's it's disgusting. Apparently I couldn't add veggies. Oh no, I did it already. I wasn't paying attention. Yeah. We had like 20 something bears on tab and it was just a constant job. Like, basically, we'd get, like, someone come in, like, once a week and clean all the taps. And, like, emptying out the, um, the ullage, the overpour buckets, it was like, ugh. Like, it would it's vary strange. in colour from, like, beige to, like, off-meat pink. I got a beer and I got some candy cane caramel popcorn that I saw at the store. Ooh. That sounds good. That's what the uh, people in the homebrew yeah. sitch so like they... to call a polysaccharide biofilm. It's not mm. great. Oh, so Guinness maintains the bars, so the taps, so that they're up to Guinness standards. But yeah, that makes sense. Because it's, it's amazing, even yeah, like a couple of degrees, good. yeah, even a couple of degrees off, like too warm or too cold can make such a big 
uh, a big difference on how the beer tastes. And the other thing that makes a big difference that people don't realize is how clean your glasses are. So if you have like a lot of water spots on your glasses, your the beer will go flat really fast because the, oh, the yeah. fizz in the beer sticks to the, the dirt on the side of the glass and for the same reason, oh, and don't ask me how I, I found this out, but if you have uh, like a black tea that you've been drinking out of a glass, you have to rinse that before you fill it with beer, because if you fill it with beer, the beer will be flat just as soon as you're done pouring it. So it means as well, if you drink champagne and it's really, really fizzy, it means your glasses need to be cleaned. Oh. Oh my god, these men are like oh, halfway hey, through a bottle of three gingers and I still have some uncooked I'm gonna put the rest back in the freezer. Uh yes, Chad, a hundred percent. You will get more bubbles and your beer will go flat faster. Sure. Yes, that's that's what you should take out of this. Oh Ed oh heck. I am Flush with overheating right now. I keep forgetting to take breaks during ads. Like, why do I have a beer bottle? We're having a little wishy wash. I washed my my machete. You want to keep it in clean condition in case you need to slice pizza. Yes. And by pizza, she means zombos. No, actual pizza. Were you there when she sliced a pizza with a machete? Mm -hmm. I was not. Yeah. I was like, ooh, what are these? Solar panels? No. The folding chairs. Oh, it's a lecture Decidedly theater? Decidedly less useful. Um, yes, if you want extra bubbly drink, then have dirty glasses, but it will make your drink go flat faster. And welcome back. Thank you for watching the ads. Fun fact, there is actually a difference between having a drink that's flat and having a drink that's still. Mainly it's that still is on purpose and flat is not, but who's counting? I mean, yeah, I mean, it comes out the same too. I mean, it's a liquid. So when we drink milk, it's still milk, not a flat milk. Yes. Yeah, we're like, only the finest still milk. I'm actually slowly I mean, I moving hope forward it's with not this. Flat, because that would that would imply that you tried to make Busy it milk. carbonated, and it didn't work. But isn't there such a thing as like a a, a carbonated milk drink? Ooh, there is a something. yogurt Pepsi. Yeah, zombies over here in the window. Ew. Zombie in the window. No, oh, that's stirred. That oh, I have shoot, no idea how many's in here. First, a zombie over here. I'll open up the door to the town hall. Oh. You hey. actually have to work pretty hard to make butter. And butter isn't just uh, milk, it's made out of cream. Because it needs all those uh, fatty solids in there. Fatty solids. 
And a lot of a lot of places will try to, to tell you, hey, you just make your own buttermilk. You take milk and you add lemon juice. That's a good buttermilk substitute, but real buttermilk is the liquid that comes off of butter when you separate it out into butter yeah. and buttermilk. And it's so much better when you use the real stuff. I thought that was the way. Hmm. Are they interesting in here? I'm hearing them. Way. Way. This is the way. Oh, hey. there they are. Whey is the liquid remaining after milk has been curdled and strained. So it's it's a byproduct of manufacturing cheese, not butter. Ah. Uh, oh, there you are, Zomble. Yes, buttermilk is good for baking, like, and cooking. So, like, fried chicken and biscuits, and I don't think anything else matters, really. Those are the two important things that you make with buttermilk. Fresh biscuits. Mm. Mm, yeah. Um, you can use it for scones as well. It makes some damn good scones. Ooh. Love it. That's true. Cornbread. America. Well, there's an upstairs. That could be it. Uh, I'm so hungry now. Well. What I just ordered you isn't going to be there until the uh -huh. 9th, so you're going to have to find something between here and then. Hey. Excuse me? Hey! It looks like Del craves violence. Hey! Look. You stop that nonsense? Thank you. Did you, did you get- did you get bit? Nah. Oh, well, good job. Tried. Tried to have a, a, a little nibble, but I was like, no. You said non-con. I do no, not no, consent. Magazine. You may not munch on my neck or face. Hmm. Yeah, and then like waffles with like, oh, with sour cream and strawberries. Molly, you're killing me. Uh. I think I've been here. Oh my god, Strawberry, waffles yeah. with sour cream and sliced strawberries. Honestly, people are just like, that sounds weird. It's so good. It tastes like fucking cheesecake. Yes, a hundred percent. You put like, it's sliced strawberries and a blob of sour cream on waffles and it tastes like strawberry cheesecake. I'd have to put down some strawberry jam underneath that, but you I don't. You, you don't. You don't need it. Honest. I am like super picky. <laughs> hey, wait, Chad, don't break up with me this way. You know what? Don't knock it till you try it. And while you're trying things that are crazy, that that you know, Twitch so people have suggested that you try. <laughs> try yourself a, a nice uh, beer float. Leave the root part out of it. Just just have a nice Ugh. beer float. They're real good. Oh. It sounds like it'd be really bitter. Depends on the beer. Uh, my personal favorite is to do like a shock top apple or like an angry orchard with uh, just a plain vanilla. And it's really delicious. It's like a, a foamy apple pie vanilla treat. Hell yeah. Beer floats are amazing. <laughs> Crazy, it's Norwegian. This, this is fake. How dare. I was like, oh, it's a safe. There's nothing in here. Does this that make it sense. fake? Well, it's just a picture. I can't interact with it, so yes. Hmm. I mean, if it's just empty... No, it's not make... there, though. Oh, it's, it's actually not there. Okay. It's actually not there, yeah. Are any of us? 
Are we about to have an existential crisis? Are, are any of us actually here? I don't know about you. I can't prove that you exist, but I might be. You... We have hugged IRL. We have, and it was delightful. Oh, Baron. Did I miss my friend? I wish we were closer so we could visit. Yes. I think we've cleared this out. I am so thankful that your stream was just randomly in my suggested streams one day. Me too. Because dang, that could have so easily not happened. It's sort of funny, it's same like Echo just sort of like wandered in one day and became part of the family. Look at that cake. Oh, I hear, Ooh, I hear, I hear zombie company. in the bathroom. Oh. Maybe in the bathroom, Rock I don't know. Donuts. It almost sounds like it's speaking. Three. Four. Three. Four. They were all hiding in the bathroom. Maybe they were just trying to do coke and peace and you busted in like the cops. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. I want that. Ooh, cake batter in pie dough and it's not rotten yet. Oh, nice. Moving to freezer. How does cake batter last more than a day, even just IRL? This game has weird logic. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Definitely have Cotton stuff that need to offload into my truck. Must grab all the butter. Alright, I was like, hmm, my baseball bat's about to, not far from breaking, but that's okay because I have a backup weapon still. I have a crowbar plus a backup. Wait, what? It does? I don't think honey in this game expires, but sometimes honey expires. Hey. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna drop some stuff off in my truck. Okay. I'll try not to die. Has a spoiled. That's interesting because it's like one of those things that lasts a really, really long time. Oh, yeah, that's right. It does in Conan. Makes no sense. Why are you saying that I got a jump scare from that? I Don't did not. Find some honey in a Pharaoh's tomb that was still viable. I, yeah, like, or something like that, or maybe it was like mead. Some because of how honey is produced, it pretty much can't expire. It just like no bacteria can really live in it. Yeah, because there's also medical grade honey that they use for like purifying wounds and stuff. Manuka honey. It's just not being pasteurized, really. Hey. Did you just chomp me? Oh, oh no. never mind. You tried. Tried! That didn't work. Hey, 
I couldn't get past, past your nicotine shielding. My hat. My hat protected me. So I'm not being sensible and popping doors, I'm just opening them and walking in. Disappointing. Nothing exciting here. Wait, what's that? It's like, what is weighing down my bag? Oh, I have all this random snacks and stuff in it. Snacks! Ooh, a clip on top. Ooh, key ring. You know what? I don't need keys anymore. That's weird. Where we came in. Scared. And clearly, I'm going to miss out. Oh god, why was that so bright? Chad? What'd you do? Oh hey, apparently I'm hungry. Even after eating like 50 pounds of. Oh! <laughs> oh! Hi! Hello! Welcome! It's the IG! The IG! Hey, IG, welcome in! Ooh! Another Project Zombiodor! I am so elegant. Oh, uh, welcome in! I hope you had a wonderful stream. <laughs> Well, hi, Mr. Nice Gamer. Nice to meet you. Um, hi, Dusk. Yeah, right. Shad just like interfering with things. Um, <laughs> I hope you had a wonderful stream. Uh, welcome in. I'm Deliria. My pronouns are she her. Um, you can you can have yours uh on display too, which helps streamers by doing uh explanation my pronouns in chat. And following the instructions there. Um, I too am playing Project Zomboid, but we are in Care Bear mode and I'm having an absolute blast. Also, very, very tempted by the water cooler, but I don't need it yet. Oh, I just ran oh. over another zombie without not without realizing it. Oops. <laughs> Poor zombies. Hello, hi Cam, how you doing? Here, let me give you guys a uh, an idea of what you can expect from yeah. the stream and why <laughs> you should follow <laughs> the stream. It's a very oh, no, funny one. I can I can handle more, but I just like being in cruise cruise mode. Thank you for the follow. People that kind of <laughs> killed a lot of them too. <laughs> Very scented bird houses make bird. Oh, Haven Dock. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. True facts. Somehow. Thank. So yeah, follow this channel. It's great fun, <laughs> especially when we're doing crafting. Yeah, I I play a lot of open world survival exploration sandbox type games, and I also do craft streams once a week. Um, crochet, knitting, cross stitch, <laughs> and other stuff too. Clay stuff and uh, digital art. All sorts of shit. I'm all over the place. Hmm. I don't know why, or, like, really, why I'm like looking for things because I'm just like. I literally just came out because I wanted a boot zombie. I found zombies. something for you. Yeah, I'm like, ooh, is it edible? Oh, I need to smoke. 
You're fine. Oh, hold on. I'll drop it. Oh, nice. Yeah. I mean, I th I definitely... Oh, another bottle. Thanks. Oh, and found an orange one, too. I definitely have a genre <laughs> that, I, that I'm most comfy in. Uh, most recently, I've been very, very taken with uh, Vintage Story, uh, which uh, Shad's been playing as well. I'm just waiting for... Um, my my friend's got a server for it that I've been playing on. We're just waiting for it to get updated. I will play that until the sun comes up and not even realize. Yeah. Canned mm. spaghetti bolognese. Chocolate covered coffee beans. Oh, oh, I've I've eaten too many of those. <laughs> Me too. The crunch. There's there's nothing delicious about the crunch of eating coffee beans. Ooh. I was referring Wait, to did we just go in a big circle? No. Okay. Yeah. Like I. I it's. Ooh, dear. Rotten mayo, no, delicious. Save the cheese. <laughs> yeah, that is true. You are such a cheese goblin. Cheese. Easy is way more complicated than uh, Bunter Story, but it is presented in a different way. Um. But yeah, I'm very much. I'm waiting for. The next update. <laughs> Wait. That's fair. That's a hundred percent valid. There's a lot to this. Like there's I know there is so much about this game that I haven't learned. Um yes. Uh, so it used to be that you could gift through the EA store, but they got rid of the function. So yeah, that's probably the easiest way to do it. Um, and to make sure that there's no conflict with keys or anything. Uh, what? <coughs> uh, is it the horse expansion because of the hat? <laughs> I feel like it's... You, it's the horse one. <clears throat> um. There. I'm pretty sure I updated that. Uh, pretty recently. But yeah, I'm very, very eager, eagerly awaiting. Um, the next big update for Vintage Story. Um, I'm going to keep this the server going for the subs on this channel uh, for the year. But as soon as Vintage Story updates on my friend's server, I'm probably going to be back, back to no lifing that because it brings me joy. Until I get like rocks thrown at me by Mole Man and then I get mad. But in between, in between that bit, I like it. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm in the apartments upstairs. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. Mood. Please, please go go get foods. Uh, I really appreciate the raid. Thank you. Hope you have delicious, delicious food. Thanks. I really need to find them. I feel like either they're going to be like in a big hoard somewhere. Or we're going to have to do another big <clears throat> reset and noticed, increase the rates. Whoa. I've noticed that's what's been happening. It's like all the zombies, we don't see them, and then suddenly they're all clustered together somewhere. Bunch of books in here. Ooh, don't I'm ask me where I am. That. I have no idea where I am, but there's a lot of books here. 
I roughly know where you are. I'm reading a book upstairs. Is like everything? Probably. Let me know if you see Mechanics Volume 5. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I'll go back to the stat and look for it. Uh, supernatural. One needs to alphabetize these. That's not me. <laughs> I don't, I don't want... Make mechanics five. You see. I'm looking so hard, I'm probably gonna miss it. Um, but Supernatural, you mean like the, the werewolf, werewolf one, or...? Apparently the werewolf one, you can just like pee on the floor in front of people. <coughs> you said mechanics or metalwork? So, lifelike. Mechanics. Okay. Yeah, it's as little's put it, you can just like pop a squat. <laughs> it's got such a way with words. Not seeing any, but 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 I'm gonna take these cardboard blocks. <clears throat> Is there a garage door near you? I have no idea. I don't even know if I'm on the. I think I'm on a ground floor, but I don't know. I'm literally just like my mouth is wobbling and and words are coming out but I don't know what I'm doing. I just saw some graffiti on a wall that said I won't become one of them. Oh. Oh. Um I mean that that's good mm -hmm. to have goals. I don't I haven't seen Mechanics 5. It's okay, there's other places to try, worst case scenario, so. Mechanic 4! I think I have that one. A, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of books. Zombie hit list number 3. How does this work again? Oh, but they clearly didn't load properly. That really didn't load properly for you. Uh, yes, but let me let me just double check. Pretty sure it is, but I'll open up EA and double check. Man, I have a, a bleh, 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 frog in my throat. I was about to say a frog in my throat. I guess that works too. Alright. Oh, man, the way they... That's awful. <laughs> the way that they organize the, um, the store... Library. Oh, here we go. This is what I want. 19 add-ons. Jesus Christ. Okay. Vintage glamour. Spooky stuff. Yes. Spa day. Yes. Seasons. Romantic garden. I know I have that one. Realm of magic. Outdoor retreat. Lefty knitting, pet stuff, luxury party, laundry day, 
angle. Yeah, it's very confusing. Fashion Street. Head in the air. Cottage living. Cats and dogs. Yeah. Yeah, that's up to date. The only thing that's missing is a desert lux, I think. Thank you. Oh, but what if these were all like lootable containers with like cool things in them? Found a uh, pack of glow sticks. That's cool. Burp. Was this another restaurant? Wait, we be have we been in here? Oh. Okay, I heard. There is an apartment upstairs I didn't go through. I decided to locate you instead. Listen, it's a new DLC. <laughs> Thank you. Looking Dirty forward towers. to my character derping around your home. 10.79 werewolves, 10.79 vampires, 5.39 paranormal. What? <laughs> What, what was it? Message. Duty Toes, thank you for that. Why can't I find the light switch? I hear a zomble. Oh god, thank you. No, it's fine. It it's it's totally fine. What? Hi, Pyro. Oh, yeah, I can hear him. Oh, there it is. Listing that is actually useful because I'll be able to use that. All right. <laughs> Let me uh, do these now so I don't forget. How do I how do I do this again? Oh, well, you can do that. I mean, nothing's been imported now, so you you do what you want. Thankfully, not very many people have have made their characters yet because i think there might be a few people who want to re-roll there's a zombie upstairs i think okay werewolves vampires paranormal Hey. Hey. Someone left me some gifts in my kitchen. Oh, really? 
Mm hmm yeah. What, what gifts were they? You know, just some starter sets to my collection. <laughs> Uh, I got a nice little red set now. Fine. Oh, I was like, what? <laughs> now we must drive this car and find more. All right, let me just in the process of getting some more DLC. Dirty Toes just hooked us up with a couple more expansions for The Sims. So we'll be able to have vampires and werewolves as part of our oh. medieval. I have to remake my character and make him shiny. <laughs> <laughs> The, yeah, we can have seances. Ooh. If that's a thing. Oh. Oh, well, I don't know what my password is. Why are these things going to ask for passwords? I don't know what any of my passwords are. Meanwhile, I'm hearing a zombie upstairs, flipping on the door. It'll be fine. Oh, it's P A S S W zero R D. <laughs> okay. I always get confused whether it's a zero or a, and an O. <laughs> Uh, Are you worried I was about to dox myself? No, I'm worried that's actually your password. That's my problem. Really? <laughs> really? I it was one, two, three, four, five. It's B zero O B S. Oh my gosh. And sometimes if it's like, no, that's not strong enough, I'll add an exclamation mark on the end of it. <laughs> or like 69420 lol, no scope. XX. XX, yeah. All right, done. We now have vampires, paranormal and werewolf. Thank you, Dirty Toes. All right, I wanted to do that before I forget because I have the attention span of a toddler who needs to wee. All right, upstairs, you say? Yep. Which door? This one. All right, open. Oh. Hey. Wow, only one? Hey, he was making a lot of racket. Way too many to handle. Don't fire near here, for God's sake. Well, that sounds hopeful, but where is this listed? This this building? That's West Point, a little more east, and that blue building, I think, is the school. Is this going to become a thing now where we all just like drop off like undies and socks to Pyro? Uh, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. I am currently I mean, scavenging for such. Milton. All right. Found a CD. Oh, we're gonna jam, baby. Does playing cards count as entertainment or no? 
I don't know. A solitaire or something? Unfortunately, no. To my understanding, last time I checked. But there's okay. comic books, uh, crossword puzzles. It's basically media. Yeah. It's, it's basically entertainment. Okay. Ooh, I found some makeup. What's a Stabby Hooker? Um. <laughs> Hi, AK. Um, so that's just me being a smartass. Um, and goofing around because I crochet. And I can be a little aggressive sometimes. And you do crochet with a hook. And I get Stabby. I hope you aren't disappointed. <laughs> Um, and it's also a great talking point. People are like, the fuck is a stabby hooker? Well, you see. No, I'm not in New Zealand anymore. It doesn't negate my New Zealandness, though. <laughs> I, I'm sorry, you're sad. Um, Wellington. Wellington born and bred. Oh, this is a big circle. I'm I'm so lost. I don't know where I Oh co ooh, coffee machine though. Would that coffee machine work? The city of yeah, Windy Wellington. Which is dumb what because that Auckland coffee machine do though. Auckland is the city of sales. Now you need wind for sales. Just saying. You can turn on the copy. No, no, like fifteen percent off. It's the it's the land of the sale. Okay. You're, ah, uh, yeah, you're an Aucklander. Just please don't mind Lipbot. Lipbot's doing their best. I may understand it works, but only for coffee and tea. I'm a throw. I don't. I don't. <laughs> I don't. I don't know what's what's going on there. Like, it's pretty yeah. cool to have a coffee machine. I need a flashlight. It's so dark. It does really get dark at night. It's dark when it gets dark. Yeah. I'm taking the coffee machine. Okay. I, I just... I want a coffee machine. Oh, you have a machete too now. Yeah. My, um... Baseball bat. Broke. Machetes. <laughs> Always good to have a backup machete, too. I have a backup crowbar. Like, wait, why am I so over encumbered? Well, I have an extra hammer. How much did that coffee thing weigh? Uh. Only six pounds. Kilos? I don't know what the unit of measurement is on this game. Surprisingly six. light. Six. Well, it, maybe it, it was six stone, and then it's surprisingly six. heavy. Just six. The number six. <laughs> oh, yes. Water. Six measurements. Six units. I figured, considering our character's weight, that it is in kilograms. Hmm. Uh. Yes, that would make sense. I had to do some thinking then. I like these wooden bench seats. Nice and bright and cheery. Where? <laughs> but where is my truck, dude? Oh, I better go get my truck. I brought it down earlier. <laughs> I don't even know where mine is. Oh, hey, buddy. Oh, gee, we've got a headache now. Bank? No. Don't. Oh, I think it's up here. Oh, we didn't even raid the Gigamart. Hi, Gigamart. Oh, hi, big old trailer. Huge trailer. 
Uh, oh, geez, yeah, miles away. Hi, Zomble. I'm gonna run you over, because I don't care. Ooh, another Zomble. Hi, Zomble. Hi, Spiffos. Oh. I'm gonna hang out with Forgotten for a little bit and maybe play some Darkest Dungeon. Okie doke. Thanks for hanging out here. Have a good have evening. A good night. Absolutely. Good night. Have a good night, too. I am still over cucumbered. Where should we go next? Um, well, I don't know. It's nearly eleven dollars. Uh, $11. Fuck t units of measurement. I'm just gonna any random word to go with numbers. It's nearly eleven cents. Yeah. Should we start heading back or? Well, I. I haven't had enough violence. I wanted to do... We could try the school. A tree snuck out at me there. I am such a good driver. I'm like moving my truck around as though I am the truck. All right. Let's head to the school. I'm genuinely concerned that we don't have enough. Like, the, the zombie count is too low. It feels like it's lower than the previous server. Well, the settings haven't changed. Like, it, that's the weird part for me, is it just feels Yeah, because I used... What I, instead of... Of making anything new, I back... I just renamed the old server save. Mm -hmm. So the the documents like the i and i files and everything still point to exactly the same thing because it just created a new folder weird with the default name i know what i'm trying to say i don't know if i'm wording it well uh, but yeah there's there's no change but oh no wait we've talked we've already gone over this i think probably what it is is the uh we're effectively on day one of zombies yeah so not at max so basically, we're just impatient. Yes. Coming as a surprise to everyone. <clears throat> hey, I heard that. Oh, let's go get schooled. Whoop! Please it's fine. Oh, Spiffo's van. Oh, and a large U-Haul. I was just trying to move my truck out of the way of you. Is this the school? Yeah, that's the school. All right. Wait, I know this place. This is where I spawned in on Molly's server. Yep. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to have to update my chat command and uh, let people just know. just noticed you had cardboard boxes in your bag. Oh, yes, I do. Uh, how else do you stay organized? <laughs> you just store everything on the world's biggest shelf. Here. Where, where are they? Oh, no, that's, that's fine. They're in the in my backpack. On my inventory. But the bag does affect your inventory weight.
I honestly thought it was Friday. I keep on getting weirded out that it's not Friday tomorrow. It is Friday tomorrow. I mean, it, that it's not Saturday tomorrow. <laughs> uh, I know what I'm doing. It's fine. I keep expecting One it to be day. Saturday tomorrow. Because I was like, right, tomorrow is trucks. No. Tomorrow is whatever the fuck I want it to be. Oh man, this I remember this place being really fucking dark. These windows even break open? I mean open open? Oops. I was just like, damn it, Dal. <laughs> oh, hey, first room I come into is a kitchen. Things make up Dell streams: crashing cars and kitchens, violence. That too. All combined. Oh, okay. So we zoom. I'm in here in the dining hall. have been here before. I'm starting to wonder, has Stu been here? Oh, well, baseball bat. I don't know. Nothing's been broken, so... If you need any bats, there's bats in here. the lack of light switches. Okay. Oh, it's ridiculous. Hi, Jackie! Wait. Oh, that's not even a door. <laughs> oh, let's try to open a wall. Ooh, here we go. Nice little library. No organization, though. Disappointing. No adherence to the Dewey Decimal System. I've now looked at so many like book titles that none of them are making sense. All the words are just jumbling. Unlike the Enigma bookstore, these are just all over the place. When you go into the actual bookstores, they're usually a little more organized than this, but goodness. I hear something. Oh, God. 
the darkness is just like ugh. Right side, the sun's gonna be come up, coming up soon in the game. Oh, big fan of light. <clears throat> oh, I hear something go smackins. Oh, it's we, next to us. Do we have a uh, mechanic? Um. Both Stu and I are probably pretty high up in mechanics. Beautiful. Um, I'm trying to find mechanics five because I've reached um, mechanics level eight, and I haven't even seen all the car zone tapes yet. I thought it was the one next to us. I think it must be upstairs. Glow stick. Man, this is such a big building. Okay, I'm. I've used like so many alcohol wipes, and I'm still it's still infected. It takes time, and you're not supposed to like wipe it and have it suddenly become not infected. Okay. You just wipe it, bandage, change the bandage when the bandage is dirty. Fair enough. Uh, I may have made a mistake, and I don't have any more bandages. Well, if you were to take a rag, clean it, you can use a rag as a bandage. Alright, let me see if I can find one in this building before I die. <laughs> or if you have to use the, right. the dirty bandage you have, you can clean the bandage and just wrap it. Oh, you're down there. I mean, I'm trying to... I was coming that direction, but I've been grabbing stuff along the way, but... <clears throat> Y'all are pretty far, so... Yeah. Yeah, we're 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 a ways a ways away. Mm -hmm. uh, can I rip something up and make it a bandage? Like yes, you can. Okay. That might yeah, be you the can way to go. Right click on uh, clothing and should have the option to. Well, I'm having no problems finding multiple copies of Carpentry Volume 5. I cannot figure out where this noise is coming from. I hear multiple, too. Pretty sure it's the other side. Definitely multiples. Is there a fast way to move stuff? Like control or something? Nope. Not necessarily fast, just where I don't have to drag every single one. You oh, can you can like multiple things. Okay, and then yeah. it'll just start throwing it in there. Yeah, you can. Hold down shift to do like with Windows files. There's a couple doors we haven't opened over here. Oh, here we here, really? They're outside a window downstairs. Just right click? Right click and it'll give you an option to rip clothing. Um, so oh. when you've got a T 
t-shirt, whatever, you can like mouse over the t-shirt. Right click, rip clothing. And then you'll need to clean it too. If you've got water. There you go. You finally figure it out. Good job, buddy. Crazy gun guy's house. <laughs> Video game. Oh, we're in ads again. Yeah, I need to make that reminder sound for me. Louder. Oh, there's, there's one room down here we haven't been in. Oh, is that why I'm hearing the noises? Could be. Oh. No, oh, this is weird. I just another outside the window again. Or a toilet stall. I think we're just gonna have to come back here later, like in a in a month's time or something. Yeah. Is it like zombies or something? Yeah, because I I reset the the spawn behavior. I think what has happened mm -hmm. is it's basically reset the the event timer for everything. So instead of them being where they should be for two months in, they've basically restarted at like the lowest population and they've got to accumulate. Uh, okay. But they shouldn't respawn inside that housing area. Technically, though we may have to tweak the gates to add some insurance there. That's one of the areas that is kind of the most buggy with PZs. It's not smart enough to recognize what is player secured. So it will sometimes spawn things inside. And when well, you're trying actually, to secure a whole block. Yeah, there's a very simple way of doing it, which is the video that I posted uh, mm -hmm. on YouTube. We are. Uh, there's it, it, the video explains like the pathing behavior and stuff so if an area is walled off with certain items basically a zombie ca if a zombie can't path to an area it just won't go there Ooh, did uh, you hear that's that scream? The, yeah so that's what the walls are good for um but they say the the way to maintain that is to um use make sure you use like double doors basically Oh, just found some black underpants. Oh, very nice. Good job. <laughs> Red trunks. Oh. <laughs> Your collection's off Although, to a great start. Although that might be, uh, well, it depends on if I live. I'm just bleeding out right now, so it's fine. Oh, that's, that's cool. That's cool. <laughs> and there's a zombie coming <laughs> towards me, but I didn't bring any weapons, so we'll see how that works out. <laughs> oh, God. Did you set your house as your safe house? Yeah, yeah. Okay, well that's something. Like there's more Close. than enough stuff back at, at my place that you can kit yourself out with extra bits and bobs if need be. I think I'm ready uh, to head back because it's going to take a while to drive back. 
Agreed. I was thinking the same. Yeah, I was worried about gas on mine. Was there a gas station somewhere nearby where we can siphon it? Or there are gas stations. You don't need the siphon. Oh, you don't have to. But you can at all. siphon if you have an empty yeah, gas can. can. Take broken down cars and stuff. Yeah. So Man, I need a Snickers. <laughs> I hungry. Wasn't before, and now I'm just like, Rawr. I'm so hungry. I could eat a zombie. Mm. Maybe not. Probably not advisable. Don't tell me. You know my dad. I, I could be. You don't know. <laughs> Grandpa? Grandpa, is that you? Pop, pop. <laughs> Up up pyro. So can we can we go west on the main road here, or do we have to go like all the way south the way that we came to get here? We can go west. You see that lower road that's kind of westish and yeah, angle angle. We can take yeah. that. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, yeah we'll I think back on the road we used to get in, and it's a little. Am I going? Oh, you were just turning around. Okay. Yeah, I think we just need to give it time. Let, let the zombies brew a little. Yeah. And be patient. All right. I finally found something I could use as a bandage. Stopping. It's good. No longer bleeding out. It's looking up. Hey, progress. So did you did you run then? Mm -hmm. You uh, are. After I got my underwear, I left. Yeah. Okay. I'll say we could probably pick you up on the way home. <laughs> what about the undies, though? I have to throw them in the bag. You have to leave those. <laughs> That's the stipulation. I found a carpentry four. I'm gonna bring that. Oh. Oh, here was a good cluster. That's right. I don't I don't feel like doing any more boofing now. All right, yeah, I'm stopping to take the map. All right, maybe maybe not quite here. Of course, just when we leave and head home, do the zombies finally start showing up? Ooh, earbuds. I can listen to my stuff without having to worry about the zombies. Yeah, because it's not like listening to zombies is helpful or anything. <laughs> okay. Uh, knitting needles. Eh? Uh? Uh, and yarn. Unfortunately, you can't knit in this game. What is the purpose then? To torture me? You might be able to stab it. Stopped. Trying to figure out when I'm supposed to turn. It'll eventually dump onto the main road. This path, this road seems more populated than the town at the moment. Yeah, I'm a little surprised by that. Whoa, what the heck? What? <laughs> You'll come across them. A cluster, a little knot of zombos in the middle of the road. Okay, that's a little bizarre. Like that one we like, saw yesterday. Yeah, they're just like clumped together. It's a rave. Yeah. Pants and boots, pants and boots. A bit dead though. What? Road crash cars on the right in the middle of the road, two of them. And zombies exchanging insurance. Yeah. Important to be responsible. Yeah, there's like more zombies on outside of the city than in the surprising. Man, 
man, this fog. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Hi, Zedekus. See ya. Happy 2024 to you too. Hope you're doing all right. How is it 2024 already? I don't know. I, I, I'm I pretty sure in my head it's still like October. Stopping to look at the map just out of curiosity. Okie doke. Oh my god. Still miles away. How do it look? Oh, car wreck. In the middle again, two cars and families. I mean, not like all games. Look, I just like driving my viewers crazy. What can I, I say? I accidentally used my truck to push one of the cars. It the POV is bad. I might have to do some work when I get my truck home. Oh, well, God. Me picking up tires and stuff and like other parts for spares. There's uh, a car wreck right at the junction there. Well, thanks for um, the warning. Yeah, uh, it depends on what the car parts are. Mm, okay. But heavy stuff, it kind of feels like it's it's generally better to like, um, like do a specific, like a particular like, go out, kill a bunch of shit, then go back out and like loot everything so you're not having to worry about fighting when you're over encumbered mm -hmm. um astrox imperium i've not heard of that one before does it does it have space turtles man i am i am so ready for light no fire that new hello games one Oh yeah, it looks yeah. so fucking good. Immediately went on my friend on my yeah wish list. Yeah, I I may have like jumped up and down on my chair and clapped my hands like a child <laughs> when I was like, oh my god, yes. <laughs> oh, boop. It is officially a Dell stream. Yeah. <laughs> uh, light no fire. Kind of jack that useful. Um. Sometimes to remove tires. It's it's the by Hello run. Games, is in the No Man's Sky people, and it looks fucking amazing. It's they're they're joking. That it's like No Man's Skyrim. So basically, the same scale as No Man's Sky, but on a planet in co-op and infinitely explorable. What about infinitely explorable? As long as but it's yeah. better than Starfield. Sean Murray basically went, yeah, I can promise uh, a whole new earth. What about it? <laughs> Starfield was good though. I enjoyed Starfield. It was exactly what I expected it to be. I think that might be the thing, difference. A I lot of people had joke big about ideas. How Starfield was called No Man's Skyrim. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Um, but yeah, Zedekus, that's one that you might want to look at. There's no release date, but I've been watching Sean Murray's Twitter account very closely. Yeah, one world. So basically it's like, it's like No Man's Skyrim. It's like a full on world where you can, you know, climb mountains and fly through the air and go through the oceans and stuff, but it's on one planet, but there's no loading. It's just like one continuous sandbox. That's a, a planet with different environments and oh, it just looks so good. The trailer is amazing. The trailer gave me freaking goosebumps. 
Uh, I don't know. I took that corner too fast. Good thing there was nothing there. Same size as, yeah, hey stone. Yeah, yeah, like it's huge. And you know, if you've played No Man's Sky, you'll recognize some of the assets um, from the trailer, which honestly is smart. Like the stance, like the, the running stance of some of the characters is like, I know that, that's a gag. But I'm okay with that. I don't know if we're getting close to you, or... I think you passed me already. Oh, really? Okay, let me stop. I think so. <laughs> I'm I'm headed back that way, too. So you're good. No, you're still keep, miles ahead of me. I just keep stopping at different places when I see them to see if there's anything useful. We are on the same road, though, so I will eventually run you over. I mean, catch up with you. <laughs> I see. <laughs> it's not the zombies I have to worry about. Mm-mm. I do I mean, uh, have uh, some discomfort. Something doesn't feel right. I don't know what it is, so... Are you over-encumbered? Nope. Uh... Right, Zedekas? It's like, that's the game that has, like... My heart. Um... There's a house right here. Well, you can check your character stats and see if there's any, like, or do you have, like, any negative hurdles? Are you, like, hungry or, like, wet? Um. Sweaty? I am hungry, but I just became hungry just now. Huh? So. Hi, Rabby. Hi, Rabby. Oh. Oh, God, you're right when I'm driving. I'm so sorry. Another dirty bandage. Oh god damn it! That tree just like jumped out of nowhere. Mm. How long does it take for a wound to heal? It takes a while. It can yeah. take a while. Okay. Especially if it's like a severe wound. I don't know if it was or not. I'm just. I'll uh, I'll have a look at you when we get back started. in town. Yeah. You you yeah. let Auntie Dell take care of you. Mm. Rolling a bean bandage back on. All right. <laughs> yeah, maybe. I love being on comms and hearing you say that tree jumped out of nowhere <laughs> a few seconds before you slammed uh -huh. into the tree on your stream. Yeah, Coda says it gives them a head up as to when, when to look at stream to catch me do dumb, dumb, dumb shit. Like, not their phrasing, but that's basically what I'm saying. I think we had some kind of mod last time I played this where you could jump fences. I can't jump fences anymore. That's you can real, jump fences. Right? You just kind of have to like keep running at them. Oh, I missed my turn. Like, do I use the action button to do it or no? Uh, you, I missed. Yeah, you got a turn. Yep. Mm. Uh, I I can't remember. I'm stopping. You can move. Um, I know there's a a thing, but I I can't remember how to do it. I just kind of do it. Usually you hold the E button, but if you're pretty... Oh, yep, that's, that's what it is. Thank you. Hold E. 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 Oh, great. Zombie. Excuse me, sir. I do not want to talk to you. Oh, that's rude. All right, there we go. Another one. Oh, no, that's I where I got confused before. Born. Versus, like, I'm getting ahead of my terrible driving. I say I have to keep an eye on Keymailer and see if they're doing anything for Enshrouded. I Is that really one you play as well? I really, yes. really loved the building in that. Did you play like a demo of it or something? Yeah, they had a Ooh, a time limited quite a few 
Yeah, they had a time limited demo available um, a couple of months ago, and it was basically you could play for eight hours, um, and then you could create a character and move on to another world, but keep the same character. Oh, it's um, on my wish list, but it's yeah, not till the twenty fourth. And Flint and I both played it together. I all I did was build, which you know, so unlike me. Um, and Flint went out and did all the story stuff, but it was the building is chef's kiss. It's fucking beautiful. We're you're gonna have to forgive me. I'm a slow driver. It's okay. <laughs> Toast has been following me with my random stops and starts. So. Toast taught me how to drive last night in this game, so you know. How is my character not amused? I realize this is like the eighth time I've watched Home Invaders 2, but it's a classic <laughs> and it's good every time. Mm -hmm. Oh, hold on. Let me get realistic here. Oh, God. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> oh, like that old bugger here. He's probably like on its phone. Both, oh, God. Taking both the uh, lanes up. Hey, that's because the moving truck cut me off. Okay. <laughs> oh, is like, oh, that's it. Right. here. We don't have to go around. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Cool. You got a little uh, hole there in your, your windscreen. Yeah, that's why I was asking about the mechanic. I might have to pay. Yeah. Pay I some... might actually have a windshield for you. Take the right here. Our... Somebody's got big pockets. I just give you, <laughs> you know, Pop Pop thinks that uh, real money still works right now in this economy. That's cute. Should I pay you with cash? Oh, there's no gate at the bottom, huh? We don't have a gate on the be bottom side? Yeah, there is. Oh. It was just... Oh, okay, okay. It's right here. I see. <gasps> you gotta make sure you close the I'll gate. Close I'll close it. I left you. it open right. for you guys. Oh, okay. I thought... Thanks, Mario. That was a fun adventure. Thanks, Toast. You're welcome. I tried. My, my poor truck is so mad at me right now. Was there only one tree on that trip that jumped in front of you? Or? <laughs> Have you met? I mean, yeah. not just trees. I'm not picky. There may have been a couple of stop signs. Or I relax and making sure nothing spawned in the house. Okay, well, this isn't in too bad a shape, actually, surprisingly. Oh god, it's this neighbor again. Always with the cars in the yard. <laughs> <laughs> hey, get out of my... Come on, get out. <laughs> get out of here. I'll split. <laughs> my place really does look bad. <laughs> um, it's like, it's like look, I live in everywhere. Florida. What am I supposed to do? It is such a Florida house right now. <laughs> With uh, the flamingos. flamingos and all kinds of yeah. <laughs> What it really needs is some That's beer great. cans skated around. Unfortunately, there's no cinder that. blocks. I gotta spend the next 30 minutes organizing and grabbing everything you got. Mm. Some of my organization, I might wait till the next time I play. What are you talking about? You're just stuff you just take in and throw on the floor. Basement. Oh, yeah. No, <laughs> in this place. You don't have basements in Florida. What are you talking about? I don't have to dig a basement in Florida. You end up in the city next over. <laughs> I love this big old van. I can so far I can smash zombies like crazy and this thing just takes it. And my engine is still decent. Oh, oh, I forgot about this.
I totally forgot that I got the coffee machine. Oh, yeah, nice, yeah. Little bonus. Perfect. I don't know how it works, but I oh no, now I'm seeing a face on it. a bad car you have here i replaced your windshield already oh i appreciate it thank you i need to keep an eye out for some better tires for you careful little pop-up uh, will try and pay you uh, with some butterscotch that he found back. in his pocket if you want to look at them i don't know if they're useful for anybody one was a sports tire and one was a some other kind of tire they were full so i just brought them you can install tire standard that's great for standard vehicles Sport is great for sports cars. Yeah. Yours is a heavy duty. Okay. <clears throat> I usually go for either the regular or performance. Performance is preferred since they have kind of a higher stat. Do you want those tires? I can throw I can drop them off at your spot if you Only if you don't want them. They can be dropped off in the garage. With all my other horde of tires. <laughs> I also do have some brakes. I'm still looking for suspensions. If I can get a bunch of suspensions, I could fix the Dell's trailers. I have a dance move for your library. Yeah, I was going to say, who's our library? Technically, me. You have the floor library? Okay. The I'm floor? Yeah. <laughs> Can't fall off things. the floor. I, got and a couple other things. I also have a hoard of butter. <laughs> it is a good thing to stash. <laughs> uh, you know what's good right now? Butter. Butter. Like, like Paula Dean without the racism. Butter. What a cat. Wow. Oh. I figured out how to put your playground thing down. <laughs> Great. I can go on the slide again. Yeah, you can. If we ever break your hip, though. Oh, yes. There is a way to sort my category. Yeah, one of the mods that I installed is one that adds a bit more information for sorting. And another orange aqua bottle and another pinkish purplish one. Oh, yeah. I also got hot sauce, soy sauce. My fridge is full of butter and cookies. I mean, there's worse things. Oh, no, look, I don't, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, wait, did I put them in my truck? Did I park in? Generators in the shed back here if somebody needs one. Oh, that's handy. Everybody might already have one. I forgot I had two in there. They're always good to have. We've we found a place ahead. I don't know, like a dozen or something. Wow, yeah, that's awesome. We've just got to go and collect them at some point. Oh, do you remember the first server where we ended up finding like fifteen generators? It was bonkers. Oh, Ravi, I got something for you. Uh-oh. See, coming to find you again. As I noticed your backpack situation. There you are. What's my situation? There you go. 
Thank you. Yeah, someone did uh, give me a giant backpack too. And you can attach water bottles to it. Ooh, that's pretty cool. I don't leave my head lights on. And glow sticks. Oh, interesting. Like, okay. Gives you a lot more room in general. Yeah, well, suddenly I, I feel a weight lifted off me. <laughs> Like, oh god. I mean, I'm still carrying all the same stuff plus the pack that you just gave me, but somehow. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's just more equally distributed across my back or something. I don't know. It's, yeah. I think it does it in a way of like weight reduction or something, basically. It's just kind of how it justifies it. Cool. Where are gas stations if I were to want to take my car out but I get nervous about gas? Uh, there's one on the end of town. It's like on the other end of town near the junkyard. You probably drove or walked by it when you first spawned. So there's a police station on the other end of town as well, so it's near that. Hmm. Where is your car, by the way? In front of my house. Black beauty over there. Okie dokie. He's so handsome. I'm so pleased with my coffee machine. Is it functional? I think so. Nice. You may have to find coffee, but it's functional. I have coffee. Oh, nice. I have some gas cans that I keep in the back of my truck, so I'm adding a gas can to it. I also went ahead and did some work on your hood there. Thank you. I have no skills really outside of foraging right now. I came with farming skill, but I don't know how to do it. <laughs> I had to get mysteries of the universe. Well. Yeah. Oh, so I'm going like did... past the green buildings. Like I go out of here, and go past the green buildings to find that stuff. Are the green buildings town? Um, let's see. Do you see that yellow square? Okay, so if you look at past all the green buildings, there's kind of a yellow square, then there's kind of a purplish blue. No, like a little teeth. Upside down teeth. Thing? Yeah. Yeah, so around that area is going to be a gas station. Okay, cool. It might be those two green squares that you see there. If it's not that one, then it's going to be the yellow, but I'm pretty sure it's a two but green things. You'd be surprised, Hobbits. It's actually a really great katana. Yeah, the two green little square things near the yellow thing and the blue purplish thing is where the gas station is. Went ahead and left the empty can in your trunk, so when you do fill it, you can also fill that gas Oh, can. awesome. Thank you so much. I like to carry an emergency can on me. Or the can even for siphoning, like from Rex or something. Wait. Why? Am I not close enough? What you trying to do? Oh, we'll get the stuff out of the back. I got it now. I just, I must have not been in the rectangle, I guess. I'm moving these tires in here. Okie doke. I didn't pee in your garden, by the way. 
Oh yeah? Wow. Um That's a random thing to say you didn't do. And then I have Not a random at all, because I threatened that I was going file. to. Oh, I guess I missed. Carpentry, carpentry, carpentry. Fishing. Recipes? Is that a different pile? Yes. Perfect. These are organized files, at least. Yeah. I tell you, there's so much of this game is like organization. Ooh, I forgot to turn off the vehicle. Wasting gash. Oh. There is an actual hobbits in chat. Yep. Oh, I found some cat ear headphones. Would you like them, Doe? That sounds pretty cute. Can't pass it up. Good night, Zedekus. Oh my god, that's amazing! I can wear them and the hat and the bow. There you go. Do they affect what I my hair is? My god, look at this thumbnail, it's ridiculous. Your character's underweight. How is that even possible? Hmm. Not enough fine dining, apparently. We need more beef beef with beef beefs too. Yes. I got some corned beef over here. Community. No beef, beef, and beef, beef, though. We'll see which of my plants got peed on. I need the good ones. Well, these stay watered for a while, I guess, because these are all still well watered. So I guess I don't have to worry about these as much as I thought. <laughs> No diseases yet, so that's good. <laughs> oh, you're bringing me some more gifts, I see. <laughs> Welcome to the neighborhood. <laughs> I got a special cameo for these. <laughs> Most of them, as I as I have been saying, most of them have been recently vacated by zombies. So just take that under advisement. You can always I'm not sure wash. how discerning you're being, so I just wash them all before I put them away. Yeah. Smart. Bleed on the floor a little bit while I change her bandage. Neighborhood welcome with tight. Yeah, exactly. <gasps> You've got a combo washer and dryer. Yeah. Hello. That's fancy. Oh, yeah. You leaked a bit on the floor there, buddy. Yeah, I guess I should probably fix that. 
Let's see. I'm gonna do that. You don't look just too like bad. You just got that one. Are you looking to see if I'm still messed up? Yeah, that's all I can tell is it's just there's a bite I'm... on my arm still and it hasn't gone away yet. So yeah. Uh, yeah, bites bites in this game like if regular game be fatal, but in this game it just they just take forever to heal. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, don't you get infected usually from a bite? Yeah. Yes. And then and you basically just turn into a zombie. Yeah. Pretty much fucked at that point. Like there's a yeah. chance that you'll be okay, but you're basically fucked. We play Left for Dead 2 mode. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, we don't have to start over again over and over. Okay. Oh, forgot these two things. Found some fresh lemons and lime. Fresh? Yes, in the fridges at the uh, whatever, whatever shop I just wanted. Oh, nice. I mean, all the food out on display was bad, but <laughs> back in the back fridge. Oh, nice. Oh, all right. I think I'm ready to wrap up. My butt's tired. Fair enough. I haven't been getting up and moving enough. And Daisy is doing a grumble. A little grumble. She's, she's throwing a tantrum. Let me in! Well, thing, she's, she's old. She's getting old now and she doesn't deal with the cold as well. So. Yeah, fair. When she's like nine that wait nine or ten this year so we've just had to bring her in yeah when our rottweiler got to be about 10 she was an outdoor dog but we ended up bringing her in for the last about three years before she passed because yeah. she was just like arthritis you know as she yeah. got older so daisy's like super active and jumpy but when uh, the cooler weather kicked in she, normally she just stays out overnight, but we had like a couple of days where she she was super clingy to me, which is the only time she's like that is if she's not feeling good. Mm -hmm. She's like a, a whiny toddler. Um, <laughs> and so I, have, I had some pain medicine for her. So basically after a couple of days, she was fine and back to jumping. And I was like, well, the same temperature that I start feeling the pain in my joints. So <laughs> that makes sense. All right. Is there anyone out? Oh, anyone we know playing this? There's this like weird guy called Flint playing Fortnite, but I'm pretty sure he's gonna eat soon. So <laughs> he's. I mean, he's kind of cute. He plays Fortnite way more than I thought he would. Well, he he always wanted to, but the mm -hmm. um, it, the building thing was just he yeah. just couldn't do he it. He just wasn't build. fast enough. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Holy crap! There's a lot of people playing Project Zomboid right now. I've noticed it's picked up again. Interesting. Like a lot I, of streamers I've, have started playing again. I've wondered about that trend. I I think it's just like a, you know, like I was kind of feeling like playing it, and then Molly started playing it, and then Vic started playing it. And I was like, okay, now I have to. <laughs> Everybody else is doing it. It's time. That's the best time to get in it. Yeah. When everybody else is playing. And then you know, like with with it coinciding with Vintage Story, so. I feel like a lot of people are just kind of on holding right now, waiting for games to come out this year. Mm -hmm. Alright, so there's like no one that race to see which comes first, 42 or 1.19. Yes. Well, obviously 1.19. Alright, I'm gonna send you over to uh Andrew. Um he's playing Satisfactory. 
he has a very unique way of playing it. He his entire goal is to push the game as far as it can go without crashing. So you've seen me play mm -hmm. satisfactory with my little like single bouts. He has like millions and millions of things. Like the game gets down to like five FPS, and the devs fucking love it. Um, he is really lovely. Uh, he's not not safe for work. He's not like Taco with his not safe for work. Um, but think things get. A little wordy sometimes, so I'm gonna send you over there. Oh, and apparently my earbuds have started to run out of battery, uh, battery, so they work so well. Um, I will be back on tomorrow from 4 p.m. Eastern with this, or if randomly Vintage Story 1.19 drops, then that, but probably this. Um, good lord, that's trippy. Uh, so yeah, thanks for hanging out with me today. It's been fun having extra friends on the server. Alright. I will I will catch you all later. Um, I still haven't fixed my raid messages, so feel free to try and fix that. Such a profession. Oh, did I clip that okay? Did, but I still can't copy paste that for fuck's sake. The pin message. Okay. Okay, I got it. Alright, you guys all take care of yourself. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. My button's not working. Why is my button not working? Just change its mind. It's not working. All right, we'll do this best my way. And wave belt two. One hundred. I think it, we finally raided. We're good. Okay. Check it off. Warning. Oh. Warning. Oh. Incoming raid. Raiders my imminent. Goodness, Yay. that was like right as I hit the save button. <laughs> right as I hit the I save. Take in the driver's side of my car. Absolutely. Dell. Ellie, how is it going? Thank you so much for the raid. I got out of it, Welcome but somehow raiders. I can't get back into it. Welcome in, guys. Hmm. Thanks so much for that. Unfortunately, I did just click save. Uh, <laughs> did I leave it running at the gas station? So... Yes, I did. No, but Deli, if you haven't seen it, um, maybe you a little too close to gas pump. I think I was, to save. but now I don't know. Because it's so big. But good can you get in on the other side and like switch seats or um, no? so I can show you guys a little bit of what we've been I don't know if you can switch seats or the car. To let me uh, no, it only seems to let me exit. Yes, I can't yes. see. So everything you're about to see hmm. in these video clips is So when you press is, V, uh, what wrong. happens? <laughs> these video clips are gonna show it at sixty FPS. So it's gonna look a lot better in these clips than than what it actually is in the game. It's why I use the fix a cam mod to I think the first one was uh flyby. Flyby, here we go, here we go. Actually, I think I've got it. Uh, is that gonna work? Yeah, yeah, there we go. Bye bye. So this is what we've been working on, guys. This is a massive, 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 massive factory. This is producing 100,800 fireworks per minute. These are sparkly fireworks.